Hopefully you guys are all doing great out there. Welcome, welcome to the live stream and the chat. Hello. I, I do feel like we're zoomed out more than normal, but maybe that's just me being weird. Or maybe this is normally bigger for us? Yes, I think it is. Is that what it is? Is that what's driving me crazy? That's what it is. Yeah, that's better. I was like, something is weird. I can't tell what it is. Ah, uh, there we go. I think that's better now. I think we're good now to go. Except for uh, some other things that are a bit of a mess, but that's okay. <laughs> so how is everybody doing? Hello. Hi. Hi, Finn. Hi, Thomas. Thomas says, oh my gosh, it finally started. Yes, yes. Oh my gosh, I'm your biggest fan. Thank you, Thomas. That's very kind of you. Adam O. Hello, Adam. Milan and Min, hello, Milan, welcome. Lord of the Brick says, seems a bit zoomed in more than normal. Hmm, that's interesting. Hmm. I probably have to put some tape on the floor to mark where it exactly needs to go. Yeah, I was thinking that too, that it might be a good idea to have like a, a thing on the floor to show where we're supposed to be. I just feel like a bit of a mess today. I don't know. Oof. Uh, who else is here? Brick Star Wars Boy. Gary Mullane. Hey, Gary. Rex the Reviewer. Creative Brick, I saw. Jack. Hi, Jack. Anna G. Hi, Anna. Hi, Creative Dean Brick. Dean here. He's going to build the Creator Toy Store with us. All right. Awesome, Dean. Awesome. I'm glad you're here. It's really early in Australia, so hopefully you're going to be okay over there. Mahan is here. Uh, hey, Mahan. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome, everybody. And wow. Adamo has his Sig Fig on his profile which is awesome oh for real oh that's great nice sig fig adam i still have to build mine you guys give me some motivation to actually like do that the bookshop teacher is here saying well laundry is done lego has been washed daughter is fat kitchen is clean time to enjoy some sarah star bricks. oh thanks tice welcome and joyce is here as well hello joyce who mm -hmm. the oven Good avond. Good avond. <laughs> Welcome to the live stream. And how is your Disney castle going? I think you said that you were working on that over the weekend. Yes. So hopefully that's been going well. Hopefully you're having fun building that one. And everyone is welcoming each other. Yeah, we're going to be tapping into these botanical flowers. So is this just an empty box now? Yep. Cool, cool. All right. The bricks are on the table. So we're going to work on this. But I, I don't have yeah. a base. Oh, yeah. For Valentine's Day, we didn't stream yesterday on February 14th. So today is February 15th. Yes. But kind of in honor of Valentine's Day, we're still going to be working on some of these lovely roses, Lego flowers. Hope we have and some enough. tulips as well for the, for the Dutch pride. No, it's fine. You don't have to show everything. But, but I we want can, to. No. But I want to. I would just do a box at a time. We can show at the end how many we have. All right, so what do you guys want us to start with? Small or roses, and then move on to the flower bouquet. bouquet oh, to... Joyce is on bag eight of her castle and she absolutely loves it so far. That's awesome. Yeah, I bet it's really nice to build that one. 
we get hey Brickham's oh, den oh Brickham's den hey again not sure how long they can stay thank you as always you can always just drop in say hi yeah and I'll try to call you out and say hello to you and uh, it's totally fine you know, thank you so much for coming by though that's awesome we stream on different days and sometimes Monday Thursday or Saturday is better fitting for some people so it's totally fine and Rex the reviewer says he's doing good good Nerdbrick 101 is here I know Emily already built this says Adam yeah I probably. think they were streaming yesterday we caught oh, a little okay. bit of it but uh, I think they were building the flower bouquet uh, Mr. Soros I uh, got it for uh, for Amosaurus. Oh, that's nice. That's a very nice gift. Okay, so I think I don't have Valentine's. I never did because nobody likes me in this world, Aww. says Thomas. Oh, Thomas, I like yeah. you. And one day you will have a Valentine. Even if you have a Valentine, sometimes Valentine's Day can be a little bit uneventful. Um, I know in my country everything is closed right now, so even having a Valentine... There isn't really a lot to do. I'm actually gonna use the Ikea one, but the outside of it needs wiped off. Denied. I'm sorry, I like the Ikea one. It's out here somewhere. I, you I, that wiping? Yeah. Especially for the big bouquet. Lisa? Yeah. Okay. Might be a little bit wet inside still. No, it's dry. Thomas says, hello baby to the window to the wall. Okay, I have no idea what that's, uh, I think that's song lyrics, maybe. Um, Han says, my profile pic took looking at random pictures of myself and picking the one that I like the most. I do like that picture, Mahan. It is a good picture of you. I guess I'm just going to start on building these roses. Do you want to build some tulips or roses? I can do the tulips. Yeah, go for it. Adam says, I had nobody yesterday, so I hanged out with Cece in her stream. Hey, Adam, that's exactly what I did all day yesterday, too. I didn't get to go anywhere. We didn't go out to dinner. We just stayed inside and we watched Lego live stream. So I did the exact same thing. That was a fun stream, though. I am definitely like the bean queen right now. I have so many, so many cafe beans. I can't wait till CC streams again. That was a lot of fun. Bumblefet says, hello, Sarah and Mike. Hi, Bumblefet. Welcome to the stream. Thanks for coming by. So much appreciated. Milk can. What? Well, it looks like an authentic Dutch milk can. No, it's it's a nice little flower vase from Ikea. Maybe you should look up Vermeer's Milkmaid painting and it will probably look kind of similar. But it's an Ikea flower vase. All right, we're going to put this somewhere over here. And then the flowers will stick out after a little while. I'm going to open this up. Yeah, so Cafe Corner slash CC integrated a Streamlabs bot. And uh, the more you chat, the more you... Adam says, I gave you all my beans. Yeah, you did, Adam. That was so fun. <laughs> I'm number one on beans now. Hey, Fabuki's here. Hi, Fabuki. Welcome, welcome. I hope you had a good weekend, Fabuki. Hopefully a little bit of a break from, from school for a little bit, I sure hope. And... Uh, Anna G says, visited my parents yesterday and had some cake and coffee. Oh, that sounds really lovely. That sounds nice, Anna. I like that a lot. And Mahan says, thanks for complimenting his profile picture. He said he went through his pictures and picked the one he liked him of himself the most. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's a, a good picture. Catchy one. I think it looks I very classy. It. I like how it's like model style with like the pose. You know. It's very nice. Dapper. <laughs> I like that picture a lot. And uh, Lord of the Brick says, Sarah, I'm going to have to get me some CC beans. Will you accept this rose? Well, you have to, it has to be built first, yes, but that is pretty funny, though. I, these roses I already am in love with. I think these are really cool. I'm going to do the tulips. Go the for it. Dutch version. You can build some roses after. We can switch back and forth. I do like these roses, though. They're cute. Babuki says, yeah, my weekend was nice. Hope you guys also had a good weekend. It was a bit uneventful, but it was all right. It was all right. I probably could have gotten more done than I did, but that's how it goes. Ah, the Star Wars boy asks what the gold list behind us is. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. So because the channel recently reached 1,000 
subscribers and I already had the 4,000 watch hours plus some, uh, people can now donate through Super Chat and Super Stickers if they want to. And the people who do so are put onto the GOAT list. Oh, did you sign up that Streamlabs thing? Uh, no, but I thought it was automatic. I thought it already worked. I'm not sure. No, no, I guess I guess we can always see if that works. You can also donate directly through Streamlabs, I think, but I'm not sure. I haven't tried that yet, and I'm not sure if it works, but... I'm going to try it sometime during a stream. Are you really? Well, yeah. You're just going to donate to me? I'm just going to try it out, see if it works. All right. You can go on the goat list, too, if you want to, Mr. Starbricks. No, I don't. I'll forego my... Uh, just Your goat see list if it standing. Works. Hey, open build repeat. <laughs> Hey. Thanks for stopping by. How was your weekend? The Craggles are here too. We oh, had a hi. Valentine's stream yesterday. To yeah. Card off too. That was really nice. I did really enjoy that stream a lot. It was good to hang out and have some company for Valentine's Day because we couldn't really go anywhere or do anything. Hmm. I feel like I should have my real flowers up here though, but it's okay. Yeah, I was thinking of putting them on the table. Yeah, I think it would kind of spruce it up a little bit. They can go over here by my phone in this kind of. The Empty zone. Yeah, my little pink flowers. So we can kind of like have some, some extra extra prettiness going on here. Decor, decor. There we go. And that sucks about uh, Vexter reviewer it says that uh, the roses were sold out in their location. They weren't. They were in the Netherlands. Hmm. Well, I hope everybody who wants to get some can definitely find some. Hopefully they'll be think, around so much. I think that they should be around for a while because it seems like a really great gift to get like your mom or for birthdays for people and things like that. So I think that they should be around for a little while, I hope. Bumblefett says, uh, you got to witness my bionicle breakdown this weekend to Lord of the Bricks. Oh boy, what happened there? Uh, am I doing this right? I guess, yes. Yeah, the stream, the Craggle stream yesterday was a lot of fun. It's good to be uh, seeing all the, the gifts. I liked all the dots and the, uh, the little yeah, dots. Yeah, those dots were really cute. I want some more bracelets now. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I need some more bracelets too. I'm behind in my dots collections. Mama Lego's here. Hi, Mama Lego. Hey, Mama Lego. Adam says I have fake flowers. Fake flowers are nice though. I used to put fake flowers in my hair. To make it look pretty. I don't have that many fake flowers anymore. And I don't know how I can put a Lego flower in my hair. Little tulip. Oh, Hello. thank you. Mrs. Craggle says gorgeous roses. Thank you so much. They're a little bit more brown in person than you can see on the screen. But they are pretty nice though. I do like flowers a lot. Yeah, it was experimental. <laughs> they, they, it could have gone a little bit better. But they're, they're pretty nice though. Flowers like are always good. Vacuum sealed in a box so it fits in your mailbox. And we tried that out and it doesn't work. Oh, BrickTube Dave is here. Hi, BrickTube Dave. It's been a little while. How have you been? We also have uh, uh, Brett's Bills here. Brett's oh, hi, Bills. Brett. And Emily's here too. Hi, Emily. Hey, Emily. Hi. Thank you so much for coming by. That's and awesome. Avocados. Oh, new builder. I like avocados a lot. That's pretty cool. Avocados are nice. Happy Monday to everybody. I, or Tuesday if you're already in Australia and New Zealand. Yeah. I hope everybody is doing well on this 15th of February. Bumblefat said, in a few words, I received a Bionicle set and it made me a bit depressed because it's a bit strange. Oh. We have Ingrid Wynn, good to see everyone, she says, and... I mean, to be honest, I'm not really sure what I would do if I was given a Bionicle set either, Bumblefat. I would be kind of weirded out, because I've never really dealt with Bionicle stuff before. Never built it either, so... I don't know. And besides Ingrid, we also have Cafe Corner in the chat. Hi, Ingrid. Hi, Cece. I really liked your stream yesterday. That was a lot of fun. Stream was hype. Even though I kept having to be taken to the witch's dungeon for some weird reason, people were kind enough to, to give me their beans. <laughs> yeah, you can do this, uh, <laughs> this every few minutes. You can do a quest. It's just like uh, like a text, sort of text adventure thing. And uh, yeah, 
Thanks. Lord of the Brick says, those are nice. Those are beautiful flowers, Sarah. Thank you so much. They are pretty nice. They're a little bit, a little bit brown, but they are pretty and I do like them. So Thomas got some candy. That's awesome. Mm, candy is always nice. I got some candy today too. Mm. And then Mrs. Craggle says, my mom sent me some white roses for my birthday and they, they were turning a little brown. Leaves are staying green, so hopefully they'll lose the brown soon. Yeah, I think that's just the problem when you get flowers in the mail. I've never really gotten very many mail flowers before. Usually they're delivered by like a van with a person in a vase. So I've never seen flowers delivered in just a plastic bag before, but it's a new experience. Uh, yeah, so the Quest thing, Brick Stars Boy, is uh, a integrated Streamlabs bot, and you can send commands to it and it's just like a random thing that happens from time to time but that's only on cc yeah screen. that's why i don't think uh i just wanted to explain it yeah so uh i'm sure on the next cc stream she, she will explain, explain it again it. if you're there exactly. and uh yeah it's pretty fun um this is weird these are cool though has anybody else built these brick built roses CC says, I've been thinking nonstop about how to set up Choose Your Own Adventure Quest. Yeah, it's Oh, like, that would be awesome. It's like if some person, I don't know, if they, I've never looked into this. I love those books. I used to have a lot of those mm. Choose Your Own Adventure books when I was a kid. I had one about a haunted house that was really fun. It should like ask a certain person that is part of the quest, like, do you want to go left? Do you want to go right? And then do stuff randomly to... happens. Correct. That'd be pretty cool. That's just what I was thinking, but I'm not sure how uh, integrated it is. Um, Bricktube Dave what says, the heck? for Valentine's Day, I got gummy sushi, hot cocoa bombs, chocolate marshmallows, and pop it. Those Whoa. hot cocoa bombs are pretty popular nowadays, huh? That's pretty nice, though. Those sound like some nice gifts. Yes, uh, CC says she used to read a lot of the uh, Choose Your Own Adventure books. I, uh, yeah. I had these Choose Your Own Adventure books, which are Super Mario. So it would be like, uh, you know. Oh, these are nice. Do you jump to this level or like, do you beat Bowser? Stuff like that. That was pretty fun. Oh, this one's supposed to be closed though. How are your roses going? Okay. I think it's going pretty well. I get a little nervous that stuff's going to break off of here a little bit though, but that's how I feel whenever it's stuff with these hooks. Because one time when I built the Aragog spider from the Harry Potter set, the brown clips kept breaking when I was trying to put his mandible on and it kept breaking and I had to get a replacement from Lego and then I think I broke that one too. Um, so I always get really nervous when it's the little hook pieces now that they're just going to snap off and break. We have Doc Samson in the chat. Hey Doc. And thank you Bricktube Dev. Uh, we did hit the thousand subs last week. Oh, he says, congrats on 1K. Thank you so much, BrickTube Dave. That's very kind. Week, no? Since we had that madness stream happening. Yeah, I can't believe it was only a week ago. It definitely doesn't like feel like it. Ago. Well, for me, it feels like it was super recent. That's uh, weird. Mahan has a great recap for the uh, CC stream yesterday. Quests in a nutshell, CC screaming at everyone, join the quest, even to random newcomers and viewers. Then Sarah goes into the troll dungeon, loses all her beans, and she feels sad, so everybody donates beans. And she's the bean hoarder now. I know, I felt so sad. All my beans got taken, and I just kept going to the dungeon over and over again. And then before I knew it, everyone kept giving me their beans. And I was like, hey, wait, people don't have to give me all their stuff, but that's really nice, though. Guys are too nice. asking me. about the clutch power of these flowers, and I will say this is pretty flimsy. The top of the tulip, if I just oh. pinch it, that there you go, it falls apart. But just don't pinch the top of the flowers. They probably should have connected them at least one way around. I'm still building the stem stone. How's yours going? I think it's going okay, but like I said, it's hooking all these things on these hooks. So there's these round things. You guys <laughs> can see these round green things, and then I'm hooking these hooks onto here and then they just fold up and yes yeah, so you see yeah. people putting the quest commands in we don't have this so it won't work here yeah <laughs> so no need to uh we don't have that set up guys it'll uh it'll be a fun thing to do again on uh 
it on Thursday. Work here, but that's kind of how. It or works actually, CC, I think Cece so. said she was going to stream today as well, right? She... Am I crazy? I thought she did say she was going to stream today. Oh, she was streaming earlier. Oh dang! Did oh, we, we miss it? Oh again. no! Oh. Did we miss it? Oh it's no! It's because it's on Twitch. I don't see anything, oh. so we end up watching Superstore instead. Shoot! I know. So. We just don't watch Twitch. Dang it! What did you um, play on your stream today, CC? I'm super sad now that I missed that. Dang it. Hey, Lana Sweet. Lana oh. Sweet is here as well. Hi, Lando. Welcome. Thank you so much for coming by. Soup. Somebody say soup. I see soup here. Are beans the new soups? Discuss. Yes, soup. Soup. Yes. Maybe that's what we should collect. Soup. No. Uh, Doc says soup can be both hot or cold. Don't hate on the soups. Yes. Oh, cold soup. Soup is amazing. We had another food delivery today, but no soup. No, but we got some pie. Yep. And when you try to eat the pie, my cat wants to eat my pie. I don't get to take my pie because she wants to eat all the whipped cream from it. Yeah. And then she just left after I shared my whipped cream with her. Then she just abandons me. Hurts my feelings. Oh, Cece, we're, in, we're not just watching Superstore. We're already at the beginning of season five. <laughs> we got so obsessed with it, CC. That show was so funny. I we really like it a lot. It. We really did. We went off onto the deep end on Superstore. So to CC and the other people that were um, suggesting that as a as a fun show to watch. But she wasn't streaming. She's working on other things. Wait, am I supposed to be doing all of this two times? Yeah, I think so. Oh, I have to do this man. Three times as well, so. well, whatever. I'm just going to build it all the way through and then I'll just go back and build it again. Ingrid is working too, but the client is taking a nap. Oh. That is a bonus. Then you get a little bit of a break too, Ingrid. So, yeah, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a lot of fun to see what uh, everybody out there that's streaming uh, has for like entertainment by the side of. Uh, What? I didn't say anything. Oh no, it's just uh, I see people talking about uh, CCs. Guess it was a hit. Yeah, it was fun. It was fun. Hey, Red Carnage. Good uh, ah. evening, everyone. Good evening, Sarah and Mike. Thank you so much, Red Carnage, for stopping by. Hope you're having a good day. Uh, does this not go all the way on here? Oh man, what the heck? Mr. Cafe is sad that we're all caught up on Superstore and Bob's Burgers. Aww. He's starting to get mad at me for getting it hooked on shows, yeah. Hey, I've got kind oh, of a sorry. problem. This is like showing, but it doesn't look like it's showing on here. Hmm. I wasn't paying attention to your instructions. <sighs> Maybe it's supposed to be like that, though. I don't think so. Uh-oh. Am I already breaking one of these hooks? I hate these hooks. Show me. Ah! I don't know, that thing is supposed to go all the way down in there, I think, but it doesn't really go any further. Be careful, though, because otherwise you're going to break my flower. Oh, hey, hey, be careful. Oh, you broke it. Oh, Sorry. I told you not to do that. Oh, man, my flower. There you go. Oh, yeah. why did you break it? It's just this one. Yeah, I told you not to push on it. You broke it. Oh, my flower. I'm sorry. It's I guess okay. this is the one that fell off. I know, but it's all smashed now. That's what I'm saying. This is kind of like not very proper. <clears throat> oh, man. Come on, you thing. Oh, <laughs> Maybe it's not supposed well, to. Well, I took further. I took this off so that I could actually like push on it without breaking it, but no, it does. It definitely does. Oh, okay, okay, you got it. I don't know. I just uh, these flowers are kind of difficult. <laughs> Fourth the brick says, "Have oh. I told you guys how much I care about you?" Well, I'm gonna say it again. I love Sarah and Mike. Oh, that's so that's nice. Awesome. Thank you so much, Nate. Yeah, I love to hear love that. Here, as always. Oh, that never well, gets old. Thank you. Brick Stars boy is going to go tired from a long last night. Thanks so much for stopping by here. Uh, if you're on the next CC stream, you'll uh, you'll get ca ca caught up on all the the stream bot language that's happening there. Ah. Uh, uh. Let's see. Let's see. What did I miss? 
Yeah, there, I got this now. Lando is talking about a dog giving puppies. What? Yeah, I'm missing the story because there's multiple messages. We had a dog come into the clinic to get a puppy unstuck during labor, and then the owner decided to surrender the dog that gave birth to nine puppies. Oh, that's, that's weird. Okay, you guys, I think I fixed it. Mrs. Craggle was concerned too. She says, oh no, is it fixable without taking it all apart? Yeah, I think I, I, think I got it. I, I think. Oh, that doesn't sound good, Lando. It seems that the dog that was that was giving birth was too young. There's there's, there's a lot of uh, yeah going around. Uh, my uh, my sixteenth birthday, our dog gave birth to stillborn puppies, and it was not a very fun sweet sixteen. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's awful. That is yeah, that's sad. Mm. Uh, no, I don't think it's actually broken, right? No, uh, no, no. Yeah, I fixed it. I fixed it. It's just... Yeah, Flowey. Flowey was... Uh, rest in peace, says Milan. R.I.P. Flowey. 2021-2021. Flowey? Yeah, the, your, your rose. Oh, yeah. It's okay, though. I fixed it, you guys. It's, it's, not, it's, not, uh, it's not actually broken. It's not... Nah. It just slid off the... the it's just, you know, when you have to put, like, a Technic thing, like, this red thing was in there, and then I have to cover it with a green thing, but the red part of the Technic piece is still showing, and I don't really want the red piece to show above the green piece. So I knew I hadn't stuck that red Technic piece down into this flower enough. But if you push it too far, then everything starts falling apart. But I think I got it. Somehow I think you're going to be a lot faster than me at these flowers. Uh, no, 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 no. No, guys, we don't have that on here. No, no, we don't have it. It was only, uh, it's only on CCs. Mahan says, Adam, I said do not. <laughs> oh, that looks pretty. Might need to get this on the next Lego order. Yeah, you definitely should. Have you seen the hundred? I don't know what the hundred is. I think that's a show, right? I don't know. It sounds like a scary movie. Is Dude. it a scary movie? Teal Bricks and Paradiso says, "Yo, that's a lot of goats. They're going to eat all the flowers." Mm, you gotta keep the goats away from the flowers. Yeah, I think we have to add a couple more people to it as well. We need to add little bins and bricks to it also. Yes, we ran out of. Uh, but I ran out of letters, so I have to get more letterbox letters, which Mal I need to Malta order. Malta and Doc are easy to add because there are three letters, but we, we need to order some more letters. <laughs> I have to rearrange the board a little bit so everybody can be seen as well. Ingrid says that she's looking forward to seeing Brett's castle. And Dean says, Mike has less pieces. Oh, okay. Fair enough. What's I'm also a little bit of a slower builder. Oh, no worries about the dislike here or there. That's totally fine. Hmm? Yes, the Lord of the Bricks and Animal says, "What's this dislike doing here?" Get uh, out of here. That happens on like every every stream and video that I've ever seen oh, on anybody's yeah. Lego channel. I think there's just one, one or two people in the Lego community that just dislike everything for everyone. No worries. And yeah, what is for dinner, Sarah? Uh, I think we still have tacos. tacos. I yep. think it's gonna be leftover tacos. I think that is gonna be. Wait, you what? Lando your idea is definitely getting implemented, but it hasn't arrived yet. So, uh, yes. Lando... Uh, we ordered glow-in-the-dark stars, yes. but they're not here yet. So, we're waiting yes, for them to they're arrive. They're coming from Amazon. Yes. And uh, then we're going to write names on the star, and we stick them on, and the board is probably moving around. Yeah, she said, wait a minute. What happened to my idea for the wall? <gasps> oh, my gosh. Cece, you didn't Ooh. have to donate. That's Thank so you. kind. Thank you so much. Oh, awesome. that's so cool. Now, yeah. Cafe Corner gets to be on the goat list, too. <laughs> yeah. gotta, Up on the goat board. Where's my piece of paper? Got to write it down. Yeah. Got to keep track. I keep forgetting to put a piece of paper in. Got it. Got to keep track of who's on the goat I list. Still not really used to this. The greatest of all time ever list. Okay, Thank I'm you so much. The paper wasn't here anymore. Yeah. Ah, I feel very stressful building these flowers. I just want them to be pretty, and I feel very confused. All right, sorry about that. Uh, so, so yeah, so we are. <clears throat> the goal is is to have uh, little uh, glow in the dark stickers. And maybe oh, we'll hang something up. Look at the super sticker, too, that she sent. It's, oh, it's a big a cup of coffee. It's that pear guy, and he's like, with his cup of coffee. Oh, that's funny. I need coffee now. <laughs> yeah, 
exactly. You want coffee? coffee? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cafe Corner has sent a super sticker. That means it's time for coffee. <laughs> That's so awesome. I love that. Uh, I actually have one on the table if you want to use this oh, one. Okay. Okay, okay. But it's up to you. Peach is also good. Okay, then peach it is. <laughs> Not to make you run all over the place over there. Thank you. I think I was supposed to have already built this other rose piece. This is... Oh, oh boy. But I don't know if I did it correctly, though. Ah. Lord of the Bricks says, Cece, you seem like the type of person who would like a lot of post-apocalyptic shows. And, uh... Oh, cut the craggle. I couldn't figure out how to join your Discord. He says, when is Sarah Starbucks joining the craggle Discord server? I was looking for it, actually, because I love Discord. But I can't figure out how to find it. I went to the membership page, because I'm a membership now on uh, Craggle Club. The Craggle Club? That's Craig what we're calling Craggle's it now, right? <laughs> Craggle's Club. So I'm a member now on that, which is really cool, because it means I have this really cool beard when I chat in his, uh, in his streams. But I can't figure out how the heck to join the Discord server. Should be a link somewhere, right? I I tried to find it. I went to the membership tab and I looked through and it was like, here's your perks. And it said you can join the Discord server, but there was no link. I thought you must explain to somebody else that you have to set up your Discord and integrate it with your YouTube and then the YouTube account will oh, already trigger it or something. Which dang. seemed like very convoluted, but it should work that way too. Okay, I didn't know that because I don't have Discord linked to my... I think the, the other uh, mm. YouTubers that were members of the... Uh, they put it on the membership tab. They have a little <laughs> link there. Adam says it's 2 p.m., so I don't need coffee, and coffee is thumbs down. Trust me, Adam, when you get older uh, and your energy starts to run out, you, you might change your mind about coffee. I used to think coffee was gross, but now I'm addicted to it. So, <clears throat> so yeah, so the, 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 the glow-in-the-dark stars will, will show up as well. That is not as very visible as this, so maybe this will turn into, like, a top top people everybody has a goat of course but uh, we have a lot of goats on this channel the there are so many goats oh milan's gonna get a cup of tea that sounds nice what kind of tea and doc says that server has the wrong rating for sarah to join <laughs> um no worries i'm happy to be part of it i love discord servers yeah. yeah, he says relink your Discord account to YouTube. It's under settings. I never, YouTube. I never linked my Discord to YouTube. I don't know if I know the password for it. Everything's already pre-logged in. I'm so bad about that stuff. And then every time I try to log into something, I can never remember the password. Like if I try to log into Discord, I run my own Discord server. It has over a hundred people in it. And I don't even know the password to it. <laughs> it makes me it makes me so sad because I work in cybersecurity and I have to promote like password managers. <laughs> I don't work for a company that has password, but I'm like I've been using one password for like three or four years and I had a family account. I said, just use it, it's so simple, it's on your phone, face ID, everything. But always it's like, oh no, I forgot the password, forget this. I it's like, kind of secure, though, because it's always forgot your password. So. Well, it is kind of secure, yeah. And I will say that at least the reason why I forget my passwords is because I use a different password for everything. So That's every good. single thing that I have has a different password. And they are all really weird passwords that nobody could ever guess. They don't have pets' names, birthdays, personal dates, personal references. They're all just really random stuff that nobody in a million zillion years could probably figure out. That is not a challenge. Um, but yeah. It's, it's, it's my own special way of, of keeping security, I guess. Bubuki says, can it be summer already? I want the new Harry Potter sets. Oh, yeah, I just want to see them. Cut the Craggle says, I blame the Americans for the coffee invasion of the UK. It used to be a strictly tea-only country. Well, you accept this tulip. But you have to do it with the rose. Will you accept this tulip? Oh, these are weird. It doesn't smell as good as these ones over here. <laughs> there you go. So it's got some tulips. Here. These are pretty nice, though. Although I will say for this one, they're a little bit too short. So I'm not really sure, actually. I think only the big bouquet can go in here. Just build it is here. Hi, just build it. Welcome. Cut the craggle says it's pretty simple. If you're logged in already, even better. Just head to user settings, integration, select YouTube, and boom, YouTube will send you an invite. Oh, okay. Hmm. I'll try to fix it then. 
It's your easy to set up. I'll, uh, I'll do that. Well, I'll do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. My YouTube password is 32 characters. Luckily, I've memorized it. It's a jumble of symbols, letters, and numbers. Yeah, so... Oh, BFAB's here. We yeah, didn't say hi to BFAB. BFAB. No, this is the first time he said something. But you didn't say hi, BFAB. Yeah, hi, BFAB. To. It's BFAB. But yeah, it's... 32 uh, characters is pretty long, yeah. Most of my stuff is 24, 32 characters. Or I don't know my passwords. It's all in the password manager that I've locked away, and that's only on two devices, so... But I feel like your stuff's even like less secure because if somebody manages to get into your one password, they have access to everything. Literally but everything. But how you need I'm to, just saying you need to have my device. What if somebody so, punches you in the street you and need then to steal my phone? What if someone punches you in the street and uses your face activation to open your phone and then they steal everything with your one password? I'm just saying. That's a good point. I'm just saying. If I was gonna, if I was gonna like beat someone up in the street, and I knew that I could use Face to unlock their phone and then access all their stuff, you could totally do that. I'm gonna ask Apple to make sure that you have to be conscious, uh, like, like a, a chip heart rate in my monitor. Brain that is like, hey, do you really want to open it? I just think it could. It just seems like less safe to me. I don't know. I don't even have Face unlock on my phone because I think that sounds like weird that people can just put it on your face while you're sleeping or something i don't know that sounds weird yeah, cc sass at work all of our passwords have to be 16 characters and i thought that was excessive yeah capitals lower letters symbols numbers preferably randomized it's uh yeah oh, <laughs> your eyes have to be open to unlock face unlock says cc so like somebody's passed out and you're just like gee <laughs> <laughs> You just make their eyes open. Man, that sounds really creepy, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a serious thing. You know, identity theft is a, is a big thing. And, uh, oh, my. If you just can keep your stuff safe, that's good, right? Let's see what else we missed. I mean, it's also easier not to worry as much about it if you feel like you don't really have that much to steal. Red Carnage says you can always add decorative pebbles in the pot and add, add the short stems. Oh, who said that? That was Red Carnage. Oh, Red Carnage. That's a really good idea. I like that a lot. That's a really nice idea. Zebrix is here too. Hi, Zebrix. And Nicoletta. Hi, Nicoletta. Welcome. Cut the Craggle says, I know someone that passed out at a party. Someone took their phone, used Face Unlock to get access to their online banking, and transferred all their money out and changed their password. See? Told ya. That doesn't seem safe at all. So if you have your one password on there that just automatically opens, someone can just steal everything. Luckily, I don't go to parties. See? Yeah. But this kind of proves my point, though. I appreciate that, Craggle. I appreciate the story because that kind of weirds me out. I'm fine with two-factor authentication and everything, but face unlock? Nah, I don't like that. Yeah, exactly. Bricktube Dave has to go. Bye, oh, Bricktube no. Dave. And Witch is here as well. Hi, Hi, Witch. It's been a little while. Hope that you had a good weekend. Hope you're doing well out there. Work requires new passwords every few months. So freaking annoying. Just invites bad passwords. Yeah, so I pay every year $30. It sounds like a lot. I pay $30 for one password. And I say That's a program. Because it it's sounds a, really weird when you say I pay for one password. It's a program it's called app, One it's Password. A, it's an app on my phone yeah. and it is a Google Chrome plugin. And I just type my one password in and then it just auto fills in hey you're at the lego website you want to log in i just click yeah and then you guys want to know what it's like when i want to use like our amazon prime or something and we have to look up like a password that's like 30 letters One, and it's all this X, random C, stuff seven point x it sucks so bad hyphen seven eight nine i just want to go on on netflix <laughs> and stuff like that and it's really complicated secure. but yeah i like that story from craggle you got to be careful out there got to be careful Mrs. Craggle says, yeah, I don't have face unlock on my phone. I'll stick with the pattern and the fingerprint. Yeah, exactly. That's a good idea. No worries. Just uh... Oh, which says, hi, Sarah. Doing well. How are you guys in House Paris? Yeah, we're doing okay. We had a little bit of an uneventful weekend because, as you know, everything's still closed in the Netherlands. So there wasn't really that much to do for Valentine's Day weekend. But it's always nice to stay in and hang out at Lego live streams. Hang in. Mm -hmm. Have a relaxing, trying, a Paris relaxing is, uh, kind of weekend, and Paris is okay. Paris is, is, is she stable. It's not getting worse. It's not getting much better. She's eating, so that's good. But not super active, but, you know, she wakes you up in the morning. She eats her food, and uh, 
She's doing okay. She's trying her best to recover. Poor kitty. Tulips. There are the orange tulips. There aren't any orange ones. Uh, let me see. Trying to build this properly. I was supposed to build this at the same time, but I didn't. So now I have to kind of backtrack a little bit. Mm, yeah, I had to do these bulbs individually, but then I had to do the stems three times. So I just did that. Oh, well, I had, was supposed to have built two of these rose thingies at the exact same time, and I didn't. Hey, Lego Madness. Oh, hi, Lego Welcome. Madness. As well as Chris from Brickin' It is here as well. Hi, Chris. We were watching his latest video on the unity game jam ideas which we are still need to get into what no my computer said it was using minus twenty six thousand percent of the cpu for a second so i was like what but it's yeah cool. and craggle says tulips from amsterdam exactly and we have rogue runner here as well hi rogue, hey, rogue runner welcome hope you are doing well yeah we want to mess around with this uh with this unity thing as well we like games a lot, so uh, we'll see what we can come up with and uh, get some swag in the. Uh... Uh, oh yeah, I guess I'm on the next page. Sarah is so confident; she thinks she's actually going to win the entire competition. <laughs> I mean, I guess that. that's supposed to be a joke. I, I don't think that's that, that funny, but that's totally fine. I made that up. I, I definitely don't think I'm going to win. I've never messed around with Unity before in my life. I just think it would be fun to do so. Yeah. But I actually have like a real true interest in it. So I don't think it's that funny to joke that I'm going to yeah, like. We've, <clears throat> we've been, been to a mm. Unity conference in Amsterdam before. And, uh, uh, did I do this the same way as I used to work with ones? them when I was at my other job. I guess so. I used to work with people from Unity. So. Well, you don't have to tell everyone that. It's fine. I don't mind. Ah, oh no, these hooks, they drive me crazy. They're just like so wiggly. Oh no. Yeah, Brick and It says, uh, yeah, the video g the game is fun to make. I had a blast doing the video. Yeah, we could see that. It was uh, a lot of fun. I liked it. How's that going for you? <sighs> it's okay. Rogue Runner says, I remember playing the old Unity Lego games, like Quest for R2-D2 game. I never played that before. You want me to do it? I don't know. I just have a lot of problems with these like round things when it comes to putting hooks on. It's really... It's kind of like that uh, Spring Lantern yeah, Festival. Yeah, like the pagoda. pagoda, exactly. And I just, for whatever reason, I just... Lego, this is not a proper building technique. Problems it's kind of frustrating. This. Like those bananas on the hook. Oh, yes. There's not it's enough really clutch power. It's frustrating. Huh? There's not enough clutch power. Well, it's fine. It's just like I feel like I have to line it up. Oh, did I really just put these all upside down? <laughs> I really did just put like all these green leaves like upside down now. I don't even know which one is supposed to be like this. I think I have to take this all off now. <laughs> you can work on some of the tulips next. Yeah. <laughs> oh, these are really pretty, but they're kind of like a little bit hard to do. Let me know if you need I... any help. Okay. Um. Yeah, Brickin it says, ah. yeah, the other flowers were annoying to build as well. Okay, <laughs> that doesn't sound... Oh. I'm looking at oh, this Oh no, it fell off again. It seems pretty similar, these... Uh, I don't know yeah. what flowers these are. These pink ones seems very similar. I think... I think this is kind of good now. Seems fragile. Who says that? No, I'm, I'm saying that it looks fragile. Like, I can't even tell how to make sure that this is in here enough. Can and then I kind of have to take, you apparently with? not. Apparently you're supposed to do that now, I think. Oops, oh boy. Oh. Uh, Is it Hadwick level of frustration? I don't know. It's kind of starting to be a little bit frustrating though. All right, well, I can finish it up and you uh, build something else. No, I got this. Oh, she's got <laughs> this. 
I got this. Okay. I just... I'll let you take a look at the chat. Yes. Everybody saying hi to each other. Mm. Come on, you... Nicoletta Piece asks, of... what's your favorite flower? Ah! I'm going to say it's roses. No, it's actually not. I actually really love lilies. 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 Yeah, I like lilies, especially big pink ones. I really love lilies a lot. Lilies. Yep. Gotta put that in the vault up there. Oh. We have Brick Bros UK in the chat here. Oh, hi, Brick Bros. What? It's a running joke between uh, Brick in it and Rogue. There's this. There's these two guys that Brick Bros UK. They mm -hmm. left YouTube and uh, they made the uh, Tron Legacy idea set. They're completely gone from YouTube. I was in the VFAT video, but now everybody is saying that it's uh, Brick in it and Rogue, and Brick in it is saying it's actually generic stuff that they are the Brick Bros UK. No worries, Milan. Sorry, I have to go. Have a great time. Aww, Thanks so much, Milan. Bye, Milan. We'll see you next Thank time. you. Yeah, mental note up here, Lilies. Totally Who says that? Which Samuel? He says mental note, Lilies. Mm -hmm. Where? Oh, oh make a make note, Mike. Mike. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well, what are you looking for? Red Carnage on Bricklink. They're browsing Bricklink. And Bumblefat, one of her, uh, the cats from Bumblefat, is named Lily. Oh, that's so cool, Bumblefat. I really like that a lot. I always thought that that was a really nice name. Lily. Lando says, careful with lilies in your house. They are very toxic to cats. They are very toxic to cats. That's definitely true. So you have to keep them really high up and away from them. Bye, Mahan. Is on. Mahan also has to step out. Aw, Thanks bye, so Mahan. Much for stopping Thanks by. for hanging. Um, okay. And, uh, Dean says, I think it will be a while before I build my flowers because it looks like you really have to be in the mood. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's a little bit uh of an interesting experience dean i'm not sure i'm sure these are gonna look really nice when they're done though but they're a little bit uh oh this is actually really pretty it looks pretty i think the other one don't please i think the other one has to go like this just a second you guys for one little secchi Bye, Adam. Adam has to step up. Oh, bye, Adam. No worries. Thanks I know for it's Monday with us. afternoon where you are. Yeah. Uh, okay. I think, I think I finally have this done. Okay. Um. That's an extra piece for the tulips. There's an extra. Piece I think for that the star is a little bit too tall. Tall for these ones. Yep. But we don't have another vase, really. Not that glass one over there. Yeah. For now, at least. I just wish I had something prettier to put this stuff in. You need to ship in the bubble pieces. Mm. Is this like dirty from like old flowers I, though? I cleaned it. I clean it from the dishwasher. It's been cleaned. It's broken. Oh. I don't know if that's very safe. Okay. You don't want to use it? Uh, it's broken, but I don't know. You don't want to stick it in there for a little bit? It doesn't even fit. No. Goodbye. <laughs> We're having some technical difficulties tonight, so sorry about this. Well, I can just put them down or something. Will you accept this room? <laughs> I. Wait, what do they always say when they take it? I don't know. Or when they reject it? I do. I'm trying to remember. No, they don't say I do, though. Yes. Do they? What do they always say in the show when they gladly take the rose? I accept oh her. yeah, like oh gladly I will. <laughs> I can't remember what they say. It's like a joke, the stuff that they always say in The Bachelor and Bachelorette. Mm -hmm. <laughs> These are pretty. Hi Corey. Corey came by. Hello. Hi A and A Hobbies. Ingrid says I had no trouble building my flowers. Oh, that's good, Ingrid. I'm kind of a spaz, I guess. Yeah, okay. I mean, um, <clears throat> we're doing the chat as well. And I haven't built these yet, so it looks kind of uh, challenging. BFAB says, I can read lips. Keep it PG, kids. 
No worries, be fab. Are we gonna work on the flower bouquet? Or do you wanna build more tulips or roses? Uh, you wanna do some tulips? I don't know. Maybe we should do the flower bouquet. Flower. What do you think? I don't know. Let's do the flower bouquet. Yeah, let's go for it. Flower bouquet. We hope this set of Lego flowers will offer you a relaxing and rewarding building experience, including roses, snapdragon. I like snapdragons a lot lavender, too. Lavender. Ooh, lavender. Aster, common daisies, California poppies, and Lego designers. Ryan is here. Hi, Ryan. I think you might be new to the chat and the stream, so welcome to the Sarah Starbricks channel, and I'm Sarah. Hello, I am Mike. And we do Lego live streaming a few times a week, chatting and building Lego sets. Today we're building these beautiful flowers, roses, tulips, in and the, a bouquet of Lego flowers. In the first bag, we have three, I don't know, coral? Is this coral? Pink? I think so. I think that that's, or are they calling it nougat? Nougat. I thought it was a light nougat. Red Carnage says, I'm trying to acquire parts for the Ninjago City modification. I didn't buy the original set and now it's too expensive. I wish you luck on that, Red Carnage. I hope you'll share some pictures of what you come up with. This is oh. made of plants. Are you smelling it? Yes, it's Does it of, smell this like is, anything? This is a, pe a, a part hey, made of plants. This is kind of pretty though. It's like multicolored. Looks, looks like kind of like a dragon wing. I was going to say it looks like a pterodactyl wing. Oh, it smells kind of weird. I don't know. It's made of plants. It smells plasticky. Mm -hmm. Nicoletta says, do you build vintage car idea set? I have the promo, but it's sale for week. Um, Yeah, I did build the ideas vintage car promo, and I made a video about it too, which you can watch if you want to. Lando says, I like snapdragons too. Yeah, they're really nice. I love flowers. I wish that I could have flowers in the house all the time. They're so nice. All right, so this is two Reading. times, Sarah. We're doing a daisy. You want to build together? Mm-hmm. Let me try to figure out how this Two goes. daisies? Two daisies. I think you need this piece here and you need like this stick piece. Okie dokie. So what we're going to build some daisies, I guess. What else is going on with everybody? The Lego Rose looks so realistic, says Lego Boy. Oh, cool. Thank you. Yeah, these are really neat. And I think you can kind of manipulate the petals a little bit if you want to make them a little bit more open. Mm -hmm. Or you can just close it up pretty good. They're pretty nice. And now we're doing these uh, nougat roses as well, so we'll see how that differs in the build. Uh, oh, what's this step three? Ooh. One, two, three, four, and this. There you go. One, two, three, four. Clip this in here. Oh, okay. So, anybody ordering some? Does anybody get the Porsche 911? I think that was available today for VIP. So that you get the, the skating rink again as a promo. Ryan says, I just substitute. Hmm. What's that mean? I don't know. <laughs> hey, you're just going to put this little stick inside of here? Yeah, the small ah. brown leaf element is more commonly used in other Lego sets as a carrot top. See you in a little bit, Lego Madness. And Mrs. Craggle loves having fresh flowers in the house. Oh, I know, it's so nice. I really like it quite a bit. It's not very often that I have fresh flowers. And I think you need this. Oh, three. I, I actually grabbed one. Okay. You need to do it three times each, so you get two more and I get one, two, and three. Nicoletta is planning to buy either Pirates of Barracuda Bay or the Corner Garage. Those are good sets. I'm so hungry, says Cutter Craggle. I think it is time for some soup. Oh, did he really say that? 
no, no. He I didn't say said, it's I'm time so for hungry. soup. And ma- you made it sound like Cut the Craggle said it's time for some soup, but that was just you. Yeah. I knew it. I'm kind of hungry too, Craggle, but I'm mostly always hungry. That's on the, is there some uh, roast leftovers from yesterday? Roast? They had roast yesterday. Oh, damn. I thought you were talking about us, oh, and I was like, no, we don't have no. roast. <laughs> I remember what people had for dinner. That's totally yeah. not weird or something. I thought you were talking about us, and I was like, we don't have any roast here. Nicoletta says, my plan is the Pirates of Barracuda Bay or Corner Garage. Yeah, the Pirates of Barracuda Bay set is a really nice one. You should definitely get that, Nicoletta. And Ingrid is debating yeah. whether or not to order Ninjago City Gardens. Wow. My bad, Red Carnage. We are... As you can probably guess by my mistake, we are not interested in getting the Porsche. Uh, but uh, what so did he say? He says it's coming out tomorrow. Oh, so tonight. it's tonight not out yet. Tomorrow, so. Well, is anybody going to get that? Then is a good question. Ah, Mrs. Crackle said we didn't get around to having the roast yesterday, so we're having it today. Ah, oh, there, there you, you go. go. That's cool. All right, so this is done three times, this little daisy, and it just snaps on right here. You're so fast. Ah, I'm trying Three to catch up. There you have eight per stem, huh? <laughs> What's so funny? I cut the craggle. Do you eat soup when you're hungry or thirsty? Oh. Uh, That's a good point. Definitely when I'm Hot hungry, soup though. does not seem very thirst quenching. Nicoletta is getting hungry so they're going to make some dinner see you later see you in a little bit all right enjoy your dinner nicoletta and anna g is saving for the harry potter sets which is a smart thing to this do. looks weird i don't because think that... i did this right yeah that looks good i don't know it looks the harry potter sets that were announced look good and they are going to cost a little bit of money it looks weird it's like not even Yeah, we don't really have any of these um, these buildable cars. Ah! <laughs> Thanks so much, Rogue, for stopping by. It says, gotta get going. Take okay. care, everyone. Bye, Rogue Hope Runner. You Thank you so much for hanging. Here or in the other streams. Of course. And Brickworm is here. She says the goat list with a heart. Yes. The goat list. It's kind of hard to see because it really should be a little bit more like... Uh-oh. It needs to go this way, just a little smidgel, but without knocking it all down. Yeah. Then you can see the goat list a little bit more, but then you can't see me. But I have to rearrange it a little bit so the goat list is at the top and people can read it. The goat list. Yeah, Ingrid was saying earlier that the mm-hmm. blacksmith is sold out. Oh, really? In the U.S. or at least on back order, oh, wow. maybe. I feel like I don't have enough of these petals, though. Oh, well, there's more. You need a eight. lot more, though. You need cause... eight per, per stem, so... I don't feel like I really have enough. There you go. I have two more for you. There you go. Yeah, the medieval blacksmith is still widely available here. Um, I think it's going to sh- prove to Lego that overcharging us here in Netherlands and Belgium wasn't the right move because it's still available. Never went to on back order like the other sets. Ah. Jack says, looks like a vent. What? What looks like a vent? This? Or something else? I don't know. Brickham's Den says, tomato soup with grilled cheese sandwiches. So good. I'm not a big fan of tomato soup anymore so much. But I do like minestrone a lot. And also Italian wedding soup. Those are pretty good. Mm. Doc is saying, Ingrid, is Sal watching? No. Then order away. Just <laughs> gotta go for it. I think Ingrid deserves it. Mm-hmm. Oh no! And Brickham stands oh, slash tomato soup with grilled cheese sandwiches. So I read that good. out loud just a second ago. Oh. And then I started talking about the soups I like. I. Did you hear me say something about Italian wedding soup and minestrone? Yes, that was yes. right after I read that yeah. comment. But it's soup, so it's worth it to say it a second time, especially tomato soup. That. You have to say it twice. 
Okay, I think... I think that I got this now. Okie dokie. Okay, this doesn't look so bad. This doesn't look so bad. It's my little daisies. And I cut the craggle says the goat list. Being Welsh, I prefer the sheep list. Super happy, energetic, and enigmatic people. Wow. Man, that's pretty cool. The sheep list. And which says, yep, didn't order the blacksmith. I'll wait till I can get it somewhere else at a fair price. Hmm. Dean says, I just left to purchase the Porsche. Did I miss anything? We were actually asking if anybody was going to get that. So that's pretty cool. And since Dean is awesome. in Australia, it is already the 16th there. So yeah, I that's hope awesome. You get it. And I hope yours comes with that cool uh, promo pack. Well, he said he went to go get it, so he should be back now from getting it, I think. I heard that in North America, you're not getting Aww. that promo pack because they had shipping issues. But I hope Australia will have it, though. Oh, yeah, this one's going to be perfect for these. I actually saw somebody put um, this bouquet into the into this Ikea vase. It is a daisy. These are nice. Do you know the word daisy in Dutch? I do, but I don't want to tell people. It's a secret. It's a, it's a secret. You can Google it, but it's a secret. Yeah, it's a secret. You know why it's a secret. Yeah, I know so. it's a secret. That's really, you know, you got to be careful with that stuff. All right, Ingrid, have a good one. Bye, Ingrid. The she had to go? Up. Yeah, the client woke up. Okay. I well, got it, says Dean. The thing behind you, oh, it looks like a vent because it's like a... Oh, yeah, it's, it's a letter board. It does kind of look like a vent, but it's I not. A letter, Sean. It's like felt, it's soft. Just to be... Uh, rewarding to anybody or oh, this we have to do three times really yeah, this to, thing yeah you want me to do two or you want Oops. you to do two uh, mm, i don't know i kind of want to experience building it but at the same time i feel like it's going to probably be kind of the same as building these other roses yeah that's what i think too but that means maybe i'm faster at it because i've already built some of these oh no. uh, we can mm. all, uh, i'll start with uh, doing it uh, twice and a tomato bisque is better than soup, says Doc. That's a hot take. Is bisque supposed to be hot? Or is that one supposed to be called? I thought bisque was hot, but I don't know, really. Because otherwise it ruins sure. my joke. Oh. That's okay. And Brickworm says, if you turn tomato soup into chiopino, then I'll eat tomato soup. I've never heard had chiopino. I guess I have to Google that. I forgot that the Porsche was available from midnight until Mike mentioned it. Thanks, Mike. Oh, well, perfect then. That is good. Good. Hold on, I'm not there yet. You're fine. I'm just going to take a look see. Yeah, so Doc says, so the Porsche gift with purchase in North America will be available later. I don't know. Um, so I think I'm it saying. was the Brick fan who posted that it would just not be available at all. I don't even know if you get a rain check oh, on no. it. Oh, no. Oops. <laughs> oh, today is not my day for building. Oh, oh it's so horrible. Right I don't know. It's a white piece, so it might be really hard to see. All right. I definitely heard oh, it make no, a I click or it. clack on the floor. There you go. Here you go. Thanks. It's just not my day for building. Yeah, I just... It's kind of crummy if you just don't get it, especially if you're a big mm. fan of that stuff. <laughs> the promos. Alright, so I've done this and then we'll do the three. Oh, this one. There we go. Having a little bit of a case of the Mondays, huh? Who? Me? Both of us. No? Do you know what the Mondays is? I don't know, feeling a little bit tired. Mm, yeah, it's kind of Mondays-ish, but I don't really feel that tired. I just feel a little bit uncoordinated. Oh, okay. Just a little bit uncoordinated. 
Uh, and yeah, Dean says, I'm not exactly sure what the gift it purchases. It's some weird Porsche related kit. Yeah, it's supposed to come in like a box and it is uh, some art prints, a uh, wallet or something. Mm, a wallet? A poster. Yeah, it's like a little wallet or something. Weird. I don't know, I think that's a big thing if you actually buy the, uh, hmm. if you buy a car, you're supposed to get like a wallet and a keychain, especially if you buy like a high-end car, like a Porsche or something. Cut the Craggle says, when is Mike submitting his UCS soup project to LEGO Ideas? I don't know. I, I'm not working on any, uh, on any, any ideas like that. Oh, you have to use the proper ones, so not these. Not the big curvy ones, the little ones. And you need hooks as well? Yep. UCS soup, yeah, I wonder how you could do that. It's just like a bowl of soup. These are actually a little bit different than the other ones, because the other ones didn't have these big giant things. I wonder, since they did the Andy Warhol Marilyn Monroe, I wonder if they'll do the Andy Warhol Campbell soup art. I don't know. You'd think they would also have to come up with some different stuff too. I'll buy that one five times. Four for the different colors. One for the under eight times for the super build. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Super build. And uh, realized I was making a joke there. How does that go on, huh? You just slap them on. It doesn't matter how. Sideways. Yeah, I, I apologize for being a little bit. Uh, the building on this is pretty intricate. Kind of sucks you in as opposed to just uh, building a building. And yeah, Dean says, yeah, that's what. Are I'm you doing. apologizing to someone in particular or to me? Or you said sorry for, uh, and then you the, started the, talking the about chat, the building. The oh, chat okay. For being a little bit quiet. Oh. Um. Jack, it would definitely be tomato soup. What kind of soup would it be? This one. This one. Okay, perfect. I haven't done that yeah. Oh, you're fast. Yeah, well, I built two of these already, so. <laughs> I'm kind of used to doing the roses now. That's why I probably should have done two this time. Technique? Pretty much. Okay. It is but it's just pretty much the same. The but you don't do the little leaves? Nope. The stem is, I guess, the stem is different? I guess the... not. Okay, okay, okay. Lego Madness is back. Welcome back, Lego Madness. I need to take a peek here. Kind of hard to see, huh? Because it's dark green on top of um, black manual. A little bit, yeah. Hey, Brixish. Joe is here saying hi to you, sir. Hi, Joe. Saying hi to the chat. Hmm. And uh, the woodshop teacher is saying if I order an extra large soup, does it come in a super bowl? It definitely does. Oh, did I miss out on something? Or did you miss out on something? What are you doing? Doing for hmm? peace. Um, here I can do it. Oh, there you go. There you go. Just need to see how you click these on properly. You need to hold it upside down. And then kind of sideways. Hmm. Okay, okay. Like this. Does it matter how you put these pedals? 
Uh, I mean, you can just kind of do them however feels good. I think they can be kind of subjective. Okay. This is the quietest I've seen you guys while building. It must really be a tough one. Who said that? Nadine says that. Yeah, I know. Usually we're very chatty, but it's kind of like delicate, I guess, is the right word. So it's good to keep it. Yeah, it's it's, it's you don't have a base plate, right? So I didn't realize. One, two, three, four, five. Ah. But yeah, there's not really um I think it's because we're also both building too, and normally we take turns. Mm. That's probably part of it as well. Since it's like a built at the same time, two times, then we uh, exactly take care of it like that. Okay. I guess you're gonna stick this in here. What? Hey, that's my flower. There we go. I can fix mine. And then that's it. Well, you gotta do the stem now. Oh, I hope I these don't fall off. It feels so wiggly. Yeah, it's. Ugh. It feels really wiggly. Yeah, it's indeed. Brickworm says it's all non standard construction. So, focusing. Yeah, it's focus mode. I should have like a button for the focus mode. All I have are train noises, which doesn't oh, really apply anymore. You should have had a flower noise. No? Tough audience today, man. I feel like you're trying too hard to be funny now. <laughs> there you go. Mm -hmm. I'm trying too hard to be funny. You have to let it be natural. That's great. Um, so am I supposed to just stick this thing in the brown? I don't even know. You want me to wait for you? Because I've already built my stem. What? I'm almost done. BFAP says it's all right. It's nice to listen to you all while editing. Oh, thanks, BFAP. Yeah, that's awesome. What are you working on? Still that documentary? Y'all are making me not want to build these sets now, says Lord of the Bricks. Um, question. Yes? Did you uh, use uh, too much curvy? Um, maybe. <laughs> I need a curvy piece here. And you need to I only used two. Maybe one of them is supposed to be straight though, because look, with this one, hey, oh, yeah. with this one, one was straight and one was a curvy. Yeah, you did so this two times. So. Maybe you have to do one straight rows and two curvies. Okay, so I, if you only have to do this two times, I've built this. Exactly. So one is probably a straight stem, just like with these roses. One is straight, one's yeah, curvy. So we'll just build this two times. And then what do you do here? You stick the studs on the outside and one on the inside. And then you chain this in here. I'm just not really sure where this leaf goes is all. Uh, I guess you just stick it on there. Okay. And then it's just eight times off. Aw, Lord of the Brick says, Sarah, I told my grandma the other day that I wanted to build these sets with her. Oh, that's sweet like that a lot. That's really nice. And BFAB says, documentary is coming tomorrow. I spent way too long editing this morning. Okay. And Dean says you made me laugh, but I'm not really sure who made him laugh, you or me or both. Oh boy. I like Sarah's brutal honesty when my humor is uh, not working. Well, it's not that it's not working. I just think things should be more natural is all. I don't think you should ever try too hard. All right, I think I have eight of these on here. I also have eight. Now you have I, to put a leaf I have on. Nine. How many do you have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes, that's correct because there's oh. already one on there. And then you stick a leaf on, on the... I put mine on like this. Yes. <laughs> okay. I think that's right. All right, there you go. And then you want to do the last stem? Um, I don't know. Not really. All right, then I'll do the last stem. <laughs> I just need to see how to put this on here. If it's just okay. popping it on. I. I guess. 
Is this really all that it is? And then I just stick the stick on here? I assume so. All right. Okay, yeah, yeah, I got it, I got it. So I have a rose. I think I like the red ones a lot more. These look kind of weird. I'm not really sure how I feel about this. I'm really... Well, there's some more red ones. Hmm. I'm not sure about these nougat flowers. Lord of the Bricks says that uh, his grandma almost cried. Oh, that's oh, so sweet. Nice. I, wish, I wish my mom would want to build flowers with me. I wonder if I should give some Lego flowers to my sister, but these are kind of hard to build, though. I don't know if I would give this to somebody as a first Lego set. I wouldn't. It seems kind of complicated and wiggly. But they look pretty, though, to display them. Or you as OCD as I was to make sure that the plastic mold on these pipes are all like aligned. I did not. <laughs> I was just like, nope, I am not dealing with that. Oh. Well, no. you can undo it if you want. No, I'm just joking. Um, I went the extra route of being uh, ridiculous, I guess. Well, it's not ridiculous. You want to put these on? No, you can do it. So uh, here's one. Okay. I like the way I did my flower. Will you accept this rose? No, thank you. <laughs> well, you have to finish helping me build. <laughs> I already took the red one. <laughs> Are you gonna come back? I will. <laughs> so sad. Aww. Lego Madness has to go. He says, okay, gotta head out. See ya later. Guys, happy building. Bye, Lego Madness. Thanks for coming by and hanging. I accepted the red one, and the red ones are the ones that count. But what about this one? All right, I'll accept it. No, 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 take backs. All right, where do we want these to go once we are done building? You can just put them in the vase. Okay, all right. There's one. The shop teacher says, remember to be happy for the little things. At least there are no stickers in this set. That oh, yes. is a very good point, Tice. That is really, truly a very good point. All right. All right. Oh, oh. Goat list. Sorry, goats. Okay, so that takes care of the roses. Now we are going to wait, 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 wait. This was for the tulips. These extra pieces are over there. These are Okay, we are going to be working on bag two. Here you go. Here what are we go. building now? Here you go. I think this was the California poppy. Is there only one poppy? I think there's only one poppy. Oh. Two snapdragons. Ow. Oh, oh. I feel like a pain right here. You okay? <laughs> yeah, it just hurts. You sure? Yeah, it's like a tight pain when I breathe. It doesn't seem very good. Ah. You want to build the California coffee? I don't know. We can do it if there's only one you need. You can build it. I kind of like the way that these pink ones look. The California poppy. Yeah, but there's like the heck, yeah. two of these, so we'll build that. That's the same true. Thing. I'll go for it then. I'll go for it. Can I have these yellow um, snot pieces yes, of over course. here? I'm just sorting Thank you. Bit. Lord of the Bricks says, mm -hmm. maybe my grandma could organize and sort my Lego. Oh, yeah, that would be nice. If she likes sorting things. I kind of like sorting things. I wish I could help people sort their Lego. What? Brixer says it's Mike with his voodoo doll. Voodoo doll? <laughs> I have a voodoo doll. Aw, is he hurting me? <laughs> well, I was right here. Uh, he did go off screen Somebody for a little bit. 
I'm serious. It really hurt for a second. Really? Yeah. Careful. Careful? I didn't even do anything. Well, I don't know. That, that doesn't sound good at all. It's, it's, just it's like really painful right here. No. Especially when I breathe. Hi, Adam. Adam came back. Hi, Adam. Welcome back. Hey, Adam. BFAB said, dang, Mike got rejected. Maybe you weren't here when I already accepted his rose, BFAB. It was all in good fun. Sometimes you get your rose accepted, and sometimes you don't. But I'm sure it was still an amazing journey. With a lot of moments. <laughs> That's what they say on The Bachelor. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're always like, you know... I don't know. Well, actually, I don't think I've ever really seen anybody not accept the rose when they get picked. Maybe one no, time, but only when they're being mean, though, and they're really salty then. Even though our paths are diverging now, exactly. I'm sure that there will be more crossroads. Yeah. Something like that. <sighs> you okay? Yeah. It's just a little bit painful. BFAP saying, lol, I was there, always, lurking, always. That's good I to know, BFAP. always for dramatic effect. Um, I guess, oh, I can't actually see all the pieces, so I'm grabbing the wrong things. Sorry. You're fine. It's just I can't see what I'm looking for, so I was going to put these ones on, but it's actually these ones that I needed. This won't take me very long. At least I don't think so. Hmm? Nothing? Just putting my tissue. You're back. fine. I need Adam O with the questions for BFAP. BFAP, is you stealing from Walmart video real or fake? Like two years ago. I'm uh... pretty dang certain that BFAP would not put his real crimes on YouTube. I'm sure that was a joke. I don't know which video this is. I, I don't know, but keep it, uh, you know. And hey, Midnight Mox. Keep it friendly, Midnight guys. Midnight Mox is here saying hey, everyone. Hi, Midnight Mox. Thanks for coming by. Glad to have you here. Oh, I feel pain. Where? In your it, chest? Yeah. You okay? Yeah, I think so. Do you need something? Like, have it broken or something? No. Oh, it's probably just stress. Oh. What? I was trying to be nice. It's but... fine. I think we should just keep it <laughs> keep it PG in the in the stream. So let's just talk about something positive, please. Which do you like more? Your mm -hmm. roses or your roses? Uh, I like the real ones, but the Lego ones will be here forever. I like the red ones better than the nougat ones, but I do like that the nougat ones have these cool pieces. What so do you, you think? can now build a nougat car with this, right? Because this is uh, a... I don't think so. This is not very many pieces. Maybe a little teeny tiny car. But well, not this a very is the hood of the car, car, so you can at least... Somebody could mock this at at least the hood of the car. You can make like a Barbie nougat car. Potentially. I think... This might already be done. Was this... Were the daisies supposed to have a green thing on the bottom? I don't think so. Mm, oh, um, they're already done? I, th I think so, but... I'm not sure what's supposed to be here. Hmm? Oh, I didn't put this one here. I'm see. almost done, though. I told you it wouldn't take me too long to get this. Midnight Box says, Hey, guys, uh, I missed out on done. this botanical set. How do you like the build so far? How do you like the build so far, sir? I don't know. I'm not sure how I feel about it. These are really pretty and they're kind of fun to do. I've always wanted to be more into the flower building because they have even a special flower building section at the Lego house and you can build all types of different Lego flowers. Sorry. But um, I am not sure how I feel about the flowers. They're a little weird and flimsy. This one's pretty strong, though. They are a little bit flimsy, but I do think that this is the type of thing where it uses challenging building techniques, but the end result is going to look better once it's done building. I think we're ready to build these. Oh, okay. 
Uh, what do we need to do? You just have to put a bush on top of a round circular thingy. Okay. And then you have to get a long stick with a with a thingy. Okay. <laughs> Is this like training artificial intelligence? <laughs> and then, do I hold the stick upside upside down? Or? It has to be with the thingy down, and then the, bla the, the black the circular thingy goes on top of it, and it goes into the middle I'm of this building thing. With my eyes closed now. <laughs> the black, black circular thingy. Am I even close to it? Adamo says, oops, uh, I messed this up. That's not what Adamo said. <laughs> no, open your eyes. Oh, okay, okay. Adamo says that his sister is literally the worst teenager ever. Oh, these black circular things. Yeah, like the cylindrical thing. Okay. And then another... Wow, this is weird. This is... Very interesting. Nicoletta saying, I'm eating a sandwich. It's just so yummy. Uh-oh. I don't think that's supposed to go all the way down there like that. I like these pieces, these little bushes. Um, so you can put them all over your city and make it feel like a forest. Or, or maybe this is supposed to go all the way down in there. I'm very confused. I don't know. This is how I have it. Yeah. I guess this is good then. All right, then we take a stem piece. There you go. Hmm. One and two. Doc Sampson says she still has it running on her ticker. I saw you donating money to A to Z. What? Um, maybe someone else is streaming as well. I have no idea. I don't know what that means. Oh, well, this was an easy flower. Well, it's more like the, um, this isn't really a flower, it's a garnish, like, I forget what they call it. Did you do four? Did you... What? What do you mean four? It said three. Yeah, but there was already one on there, it's supposed to be four. Oh. No, what do you mean? I don't know, I'm confused. What do you mean there's supposed to be one on here? It said to do three. Yeah, but there was already one on the end, so there you go. Mm. Yeah, I think I've seen that uh, A to Z of Lego. I don't know if they've been here, but uh, it's, it's a, new LEGO a small new Lego channel. Oh, that's nice. Ah, now we're going to build these Snapdragons, huh? Um, I guess so. Okay, and here we go. Hey, Solo Brick Builder is here. Cat tails. Yes, they are. Mm -hmm. Who is that what he said? Midnight Fox sent that. Oh. Sorry. Sorry, I'm not reading the chat, so when I'm listening to you, that's the only information I'm gaining. But yeah, uh, Solo Brick Builder is here. Hey, Darren. Hi, Darren. And look what we have here. For some reason, I have this feeling that this is the worst stream that we've ever done. Okay. Huh? Did you want to know why? No. You don't? Why do you walk away? No, Ferris is walking in here. Hey, Ferris. You okay? I feel like it's really complicated and all this stuff keeps breaking. You okay, Ferris? Uh... What are those green stacked bushes supposed to be asked, Doc? Oh yeah, I think that was already answered. They are cattails. So it's kind of like the garnish that you pick out when you make a bouquet. Sometimes you get baby's breath, sometimes you get these cattails. It's just kind of like, I, th I don't think that they call it garnish though. I just can't really remember what the name is that they use when you make a bouquet at the store. Maybe it is called garnish though, but I don't think so. Some food bears. Yeah, she doesn't like that food. 
She doesn't want it. Don't be silly. It's a chillin' stream, um, says Brixish. And BFAB says, I disagree. I like this stream. Aw, thanks, BFAB. That makes me feel a little bit better. Yeah, don't worry. Yeah, we don't have to build everything like, I feel perfectly like, in one go. I feel like I'm just kind of a little bit chaotic today and a little bit messy and I keep breaking all this stuff so I'm a little bit quieter. I just feel a little weird. Sorry. Oh, you guys are having a good stream, says Midnight Mox. Aw, thanks Midnight Mox. That's so kind. I appreciate it. Uh, There's a question from you for Nicoletta. What's okay. your favorite series of minifigures? Ooh. That's a good question, Nicoletta. I feel like I need to really have these types of answers prepared. Right off the top of my head, I will say one of my very favorite minifigure series is definitely the Disney CMF Series 1. That had a lot of really cool figures in it, especially the um, the villains like Ursula and Maleficent. Really cool stuff. It also has Ariel, Alice, Peter Pan. That's a really nice, uh, nice CMF series. Yeah. Mm-hmm. There's a lot of really good ones. Oh, Ooh, but you know what? It's actually not my very favorite, but it is one of my favorites. I don't know if I should tell you guys what my very favorite is or if I should save it for a video in the future. That, that one? Yeah, that one. You guys, some of you might be able to guess what my favorite CMF series is if you think about my recent obsession with football stickers. If you think about that, then you might be able to guess what my favorite CMF series potentially is. Yeah, you're not the only one. Mr. Soros is here. Hey, Mr. Soros, saying, I built that set yesterday on <laughs> and it was a pain. Oh, Ross. Worth it, though. You're making me feel so much better because I'm just feeling like this is the worst thing I've ever done in my life. <laughs> so I'm doing it so bad. Are you already? No, you're still on step eight. I'm still here. And actually, I don't think I've done as much as you have. I didn't realize we were supposed to do this twice. Yes, yeah, that's step eight. Yes, BFAP is saying the Deutsche Fußballbund, which stands for German We won't confirm or deny, though, but that's an excellent and interesting guess, BFAP. No confirmation, though, but... Hmm. Adamo is saying your favorite CMF is the soccer CMF. It's okay, says Dean. It looks like a stressful build. It's just, yeah, I don't know what it is about this. It's very pretty, but since it's not very stable in your hands, you you feel like you're breaking it. And with all these hook pieces, you're really like worried you might accidentally snap it up. I really thought I broke that rose when I was messing the red one in the beginning of the stream. I really thought I broke one of those panel pieces. What's up, Sarah? Are you asking or is someone in the chat asking? I'm asking what's up, Sarah. I don't know. I just don't feel very good. Well, how can we change your uh, point of view? I don't know. Paris, are you okay? Yeah, she's going around the floor eating her like leftover foods. <laughs> Aww. Dean also says the soccer one. Yeah. BFAP says the DFB is one of my favorite ones too. Cost me two hundred and twenty dollars to complete the full series those are just really cool figures i guess i'll spoil it for you guys is there something super funny uh, yeah. um they're uh i just really like the little man army which i think i'm gonna make a video about it because i, I really like them a lot Mr. Shore says, wait till you get to the Aster Flower. That one was the worst. Is that what you were laughing about? That was indeed why I was laughing around. And Brixish, oh, maybe you should read the chat because I'm reading the chat and I clearly see that you're not enjoying that I'm reading the chat ahead of you, so. Oh, it's fine. I just don't know sometimes what's happening is all. Like, it's, if you're laughing when I'm, like, responding to somebody, it's kind of weird because I feel like you're laughing at me. No, I'm not. Because you don't read it out loud and just mm. start laughing, and then I'm like, mm, don't really know what's going on. Um, where were we at in the chat? I actually don't even see the Brixish comment that you were gonna read. 
Unless it's this one. Yeah, it's Let's all hug Sarah. Group hug. Oh, thanks, Joe. You guys don't have to do that. No, it's fine, really. It's totally fine. I don't, I don't, I'm just having, like, um, an off day, I guess. And um, Doc Samson wants to know, is quarantine over for you guys? No, we're still on lockdown. So we couldn't really do anything over the weekend for Valentine's Day either. We're just stuck inside, which isn't the most fun. Hmm? Oh, it's really painful. You, you want some pills or something? No. I don't think that's probably an appropriate thing to ask on the stream. Anyways, well, like that sounds really awkward. You mean like a ibuprofen or something? Yes, but like it sounds aspirin. really awkward to be like, want some pills? Aspirin. I know, but that sounds so horrible. I hope it's not like in trouble already for saying something like that on the stream. You admit, though, that doesn't really sound the, the most uh, Landa proper, saying, perhaps. All right, I got to go. I have to go brave the cold and exercise her horse. Okay, See bye, Lando. bye, Lando. Thanks for coming by. Say hi to the horse for us. Mm. Oh, this is so flimsy. Oof. Yeah. Adam O is saying they really like the monster series. That's series 14. Oh, yeah, that's a good one, Adam. I do like that one a lot, too. I especially like the witch. Um, what's your favorite figures in series 14? I think he said he got the Frankenstein one. Oh, that's, that's a good one, yeah. Um, BFAB says, no, you can't get in trouble for that. That's good. That's good, then. I think I've kind of built this page so far. Isn't that nice? Brixis says, I don't care what you say, I want to hug you. Aw, thanks. That's sweet. I just know sometimes some people don't want to give me hugs, only on stream. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Did I reject you earlier or something? Not today. <laughs> Not today. Seems very awkward. It's like it is awkward. I, no I don't feel good. I don't either. That's what I'm saying. It's I don't not like feel we good. Had this massive fight or no, something. no. And we're just it's like, uh... no. I just I just don't feel good today. That's what I'm trying to communicate. I don't feel very good. My I have like a really sharp pain in my chest, yeah, and I don't Dean know says, if you're noticing that. Burn? I don't know. How do you get heartburn, Dean? Well, you just had a cup of coffee. Mm, I don't know. It hurts though. I don't. I don't enjoy it. Was there anything I can do? No. Anything. Well, I don't know. I'm not sure. I don't think so. Tacos. Yeah, we can have tacos after we're done streaming. Oh, after we're done streaming. I want to eat that on on stream. Bye, Nicoletta. Bye. Go. See you next time. I don't know. I'm not a it's fine. licensed uh, doctor, so I can pinpoint exactly what's going on. No, it'll probably go away. Sometimes when I have a little bit of stress, it just hurts. Doc says you two need to go out cooped up too much. Uh, when's the last time we were? We're going to go out tomorrow. Well, I think you are. Oh, you're not coming with me? I don't know, because we're supposed to have stuff coming in the mail, and I don't want to miss the cat's food. But if, that, if the cat so, food stays here, then you come with me? Probably. You have to go make a pickup at a store. I think there's actually more of these now. Yes. Four more. Whew. All right, I can do this. You need sunshine and laughter. Aw, who yeah. says that? Doc? Aw, oh, I like that. Unfortunately, there's not a lot of sunshine here because it's just like gray, icy, snowy. But it's 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 fair point though. We do really do need to go outside. And Brickham's Dance says it could be indigestion. Mm. But it's up here, right? So yeah, it's like up really high. Fresh air and a glass of water. You want some water? No. No? Dean says, anchovies do it to me. <laughs> anchovies? That's weird, Dean. I like that. I Sarah, like that. A pair of uh, uh, sardines. We haven't given her a sardine treat yet. 
Okay, I think this is this is kind of it. How about you? Kind of hard to see because it's so uh, flimsy. Oh, we need these petals. Item O says, "Have a bowl of soup." Nah, I don't think I want soup right now. But thanks, Adam. I don't like soup anymore. I we have chicken <laughs> soup. Maybe that will help. Maybe. Uh, um. oh. What is it? I need a curvy one again. Um, are you sure you're only supposed to be doing this once? Maybe one straight and one's curvy? Does it say once or twice for the stem? So one's probably going to be curvy and one's going to be straight. There you go. Let me take this. Thanks. At least that's my guess on that. Adam says there's supposed to be an emoji. There is an emoji. Yeah, it's super cute. It kind of looks like a really adorable bowl of ramen. It's ramen. I want some ramen, says Adamo. I could go for some really good ramen. Proper ramen, yeah. I could definitely go for that. That's to say you don't want to go for the ramen that we have up here. No, that stuff has really spicy stuff. I don't really like it very much. Hey, look what we have here. It is Lego Mike saying hello. Oh, sorry, I had some stuff going on here today. Hi, Lego Mike. Thanks for coming by. That's really awesome. Hope you had a nice weekend. Yeah, I hope you had a nice weekend as well. Hopefully not working too much out there. And Thomas asks, who wants Kentucky Fried Chicken? Adam O raises his hand. Do you want Kentucky Fried Chicken? No, I don't think that that would make me feel better right now. Is this supposed to be an extra piece? Were there supposed to be two of those inside of these the cattails? Yeah. Or is there only one? Did you do two? No, I did one. No, there was supposed to be two. Okay, well, you don't have to take mine apart. I can fix it. I'm sorry. I was just going to pop the top one off and yeah, then everything else came off. but I could fix it. If mine is the one that's messed up, I can fix it. I don't know. Here. Well, here. it's fine. You can fix it. You've already taken it apart no. now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. I feel like I messed up all the flowers that I built. Well, I messed up too. Uh. I broke my tulips multiple times. Well, at least you got to fix your tulips. Mm -hmm. Well, you fixed yours too. No, I didn't fix my stuff. Is this eight? I think yeah. it's eight. Midnight Mox wants Popeyes. I don't think you have you ever had Popeyes. I don't think I've ever eaten at a Popeyes restaurant before, but they used to have Popeyes chicken fries in my school lunch. <laughs> Lego Mike says, Eight? I like the board behind you. This is temporarily the gold list for everybody who donated since we've been fortunate enough to turn that on. And uh, we need to add some more people to it, but we ran out of letters. So uh, some names are kind of messy, but we have some other plans as well, but we're waiting for a Amazon delivery. And uh, yeah. Um. Oh, you weren't done yet. I don't know. I'm actually not really sure. This is I, what you were working on. I sure hope that this is right. Is really? <laughs> it's just supposed to be like at this weird angle like this? I guess. 
I don't know. This seems really weird. I don't oh, know I feel like this is going to break. I may buy this for my mother as a Mother's Day present. You should, Adam. I think that that's a really nice gift. Just be aware that it's a little bit... This looks really weird. I don't think that this seems right at all. <laughs> well, actually, is it really supposed to be like this? It didn't say to click it on yet, so mm. maybe they'll have one more alternative step. This looks weird. Adam says this makes a great display piece. You're not wrong, Adam. Definitely does make a really nice display piece. It says if you have heartburn, you need to have Yeah, I was just heartburn. about to read that. It says? Yeah, Dean. He yeah, said Dean. Yeah. Dean says. Oh, I was going to read it. Right, I'm off chat duty. Huh? I can't have him with anymore. You're fine. No, I'm just I just don't know what you're saying, so this looks weird. Brooke is here and says, anyone know when the Disney castle will retire? No, I sadly do not know that, but I would definitely get it if you're interested in Disney castle because I think that that's a really great set. Thomas says, what would you like today from Popeye's chicken? We sell Popeye's chicken sandwiches. We sell chicken. I don't know what it's called. Just started working there. We also sell soda pop. I think I would definitely take a chicken tenders. If you guys have like Popeye's chicken tenders, I would definitely be down for that. And definitely a chicken sandwich too. Orange Bricks is here, by the way. Hello, Orange Bricks. Hey, Orange Bricks. Yours looks nice. I feel like mine looks really weird. Although it says, it shows in the picture that it's curvy. Thomas says, bro, you're late. No, nobody's ever late. People can show up whenever they want to. It's totally okay. fine. You're all Gandalfs. That's the 200-year flower, says Lego Mike. Last bag for the flower bouquet. This seems simple, except for the Astro one. We're already on the last, last part. That was pretty fast. You can definitely see how you need more flowers to kind of supplement this bouquet. Aw, thanks, Nate. Lord of the Bricks says, Sarah, I'm just chilling in the background. Thank you. Surfboards? Hmm? It's green surfboards. Oh, that is weird. Maybe they're like leaves or something? Maybe. I don't know. Thomas says for Valentine's Day, I got my baby brothers and my mom some gifts. I got my mom a hundred dollars and I got my baby brothers some toys and a stroller and stuff because I love them. That's nice, Thomas. All right. You want to do this intricate aster one? Um, you can do it. <laughs> Go for it. I think I'm kind of overbuilding the flowers for right now. I'm just going to take a break from the flowers. And uh, Lord of the Bricks says I've been here the entire time. Aw, thank you so much. I do really appreciate that. I think that we watched most of um, Land of Sweet stream yesterday. I think we were there for most of that. And we try to watch all the streams that we can as well. I really appreciate that though, Nate. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know what's happening here with some of the hands up if you've seen certain movies in the chat. I don't know what that movie is, so I'm not going to talk about it because I'm not sure if that's appropriate. Um, do you know what that is? Is that a scary movie? Yeah, it sounds kind of like a scary kind of like movie. A movie. I, I don't know about that. <laughs> I have not seen that, so I cannot make commentary on it. And Brixish says, maybe it's in case the flowers want to go surfing or the surfboards. I think they're like paddles. Makes sense.
Dean says the bonsai tree went by really quickly as well. Yeah, I really enjoyed your commentary on your thoughts on the bonsai tree. You had some really interesting things to say about it. Like it has a lot of pieces, but it doesn't really feel like that much of a build because a lot of the pieces are just the dirt that you pour in. Yeah, the back three is just like open <laughs> and pour it in. Right? I haven't built that one there. yet, but yeah, that's a that's a fair point. Adam says, not bad, $69.99 Canadian. Hmm. I think that's good since it's for my mom. I'll buy it in May. Aw, that's nice, Adam. I think you should. That's a really nice gift. I'm sure she will love that. It's really sweet. You can build it together if you want. Mm hmm. Exactly. That's nice. Even though I have coffee, I still feel really tired. I think I liked building the Disney train station a lot better than building these flowers. Well, we're definitely not doing flowers on Thursday, right? No. You guys will get to vote, actually, by the time Thursday rolls around. I thought that I was going to do a community post in the last couple days, but I realized we were going to work on these flowers today. So the community vote post will be available before Thursday. And then whatever you guys vote for is what will start on Thursday, I think. Put that up tomorrow? Huh? Do we put that up tomorrow, the community post? I will, if I feel like doing it tomorrow. Okay. If I don't put it up tomorrow, then I'll put it up on Wednesday. <laughs> mm -hmm. But you'll see it on either tomorrow or Wednesday. At least before Thursday, you'll have the opportunity to vote on that. What are some of our choices? That I have not completely decided yet, oh. so best to wait, because I haven't completely 100% decided what the choices are going to be. JT Studios is back. Hi, JT Studios. Welcome. Brixer says bag three was so stressful on the bonsai tree. Is that the dirt one? Yeah, it's just open and pour. <laughs> That's funny. Funny Joe. Um, yeah, Adam, you're not wrong. He says these flowers seem like a pickle to build. <laughs> I like that expression. They seem like a pickle. Yeah, I, I'm not sure that this was the most fun I've ever had building Lego. They look really pretty, though. I will say that, that they look really pretty, especially when I arrange it a little bit more. Least favorite set? No, I don't want to say that because I do like the final presentation on them. I just didn't really enjoy building them very much. I don't know. I'm not sure. And Brooke wants to know, what's the longest a set has taken you to build? And I think Adam is right about that. He says, I think it's the gardens for her. It took seven or eight streams to build the gardens. And I think Adam is right. I think that's definitely the longest time that we've spent building a set. It took us 20 and a half hours to build that one. 20 and a half. It is also the biggest set that hours. we've ever built. So. Yeah. There's only one bigger set that we have in our possession right now. And Dean wants to know, have you built the Creator Toy Store yet? I love this little rocket ride. It's so awesome. I have built the Creator Toy Shop, and that's a really nice one. It's really cute. And I actually had it incorporated in my Winter Village this year, so I thought it fit in really well with the winter stuff and a, a toy store where people can go and shop for Christmas presents. And the rocket ride outside is really cute. It reminds me of that Gift With Purchase rocket ride. That was an idea set, right? Yes. So that's pretty cool. An ideas promo. Oh, Lord of the Bricks has to go. He says, now that I've said I've been here the entire time, I have to go for now. I'm going to go shovel some snow. No problem, Nate. Thank you so much for hanging. And hopefully you will uh, work through that show snuffling. Show? <laughs> I can't even talk. Snow shoveling quickly because that's not a fun chore to do. But don't freeze. And Chris is here, Brick Studio. Hi, Chris. Thank you for coming by the stream. Zbrick says, what's your favorite set? I think it's Welcome to Apocalypseburg right now is my favorite. Followed up closely by the Disney Castle. I think those are my favorite sets. And Adam says, we got snow yesterday. I'm so happy, but we're getting a storm. So even more excited for snow. Yeah, the snow here is kind of melting away, so I don't think we're going to have snow too much longer here. It seems to be melting slowly. 
Brick Studio says, you're welcome. How's your night? It's going well, Chris. It's a little bit stressful because building these Lego flowers is not easy. These are not Lego, you guys. But these ones are, and they are kind of, kind of a, a little bit of a pickle to build. I'll use Adam O's expression on that. They're definitely a little bit of a pickle to build. That is for sure. Laura the Brick sends a heart for Sarah and Mike. Thank you so much, Nate. Have a good one. Enjoy doing your errands. Thanks, Nate. Mm -hmm. Stay warm, Lord of the Bricks, says Lego Mike. Yeah, exactly. Don't freeze. It's cold out there. Stressful? No. Mm hmm Just be careful not to demonetize the stream. We are closed. We are closed. Try to keep it calm. What are your goals for this year, says Brick Studio? Uh, it's still my goal to create a proper Lego city by the end of 2021. And other than that, I don't know if you mean Lego goals or YouTube goals or just goals in general, but a general goal of mine is probably going to be to save up maybe to afford monthly car expenses potentially because I really kind of want a car again, but that's sort of a personal goal. Lego goals, I think, is just to work through the backlog and to get the Lego city up and running by end of 2021. And YouTube goals, I think. Gosh, I don't think I have a YouTube goal anymore now that I've reached the 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours. I'm not sure what my next YouTube goal should really be. That's Gotta it. think about that one. But that's a good question, Chris. What about you? What are some of your goals for 2021? Lord of the Bricks says he's afraid to go outside. Oh, gosh. Well, be careful. It's being a dill pickle. Says Lego Mike. Yeah, definitely. Thanks for the smile emoji, Thomas. That's nice. Adam says, my goal is to only buy five sets this year. Me buying for other people does not count. That's a good one. Five sets isn't a lot though, Adam. I don't know. That seems like a tough goal. That's a good challenge. And Bricktube Dave has returned. Hey, Bricktube Dave, welcome back. Welcome back. Adam says, snow is fun. We didn't really enjoy the snow. It snowed here and it never snows in the Netherlands, but we didn't really go outside and enjoy it at all. I don't know. Have you ever been like uh, snow sledding? No. What's your favorite snow-related activity? Oh, no. What's wrong? My bed is wrong. Oh, uh, that's okay. It looks pretty nice. <laughs> oh, boy. Prickworm says I've already bought way more than that, adam -o. And Adam says that he got 10 last year. You've already got three, Adam? And you only want to buy five for the whole year? Mm. It's only uh, only February, Adam. Lord of the Brick says, Sarah, I'm worried if I don't start my car today, it's not going to start tomorrow when I need to run some important adult errands. Uh, yeah, that is a good point. Cars definitely don't like to sit around in the cold. Did it really snow so much where you are? That's crazy. That's really crazy. I lived uh, in some of the colder parts of the United States for a while, so I'm used to the snow, but... You got it? Mm -hmm. Brick Tube Dave says, I'm in Illinois and it's snowing like a mother. <laughs> wow. That's crazy. Sounds like it would be snowy in Illinois, though. Brick Studio says, I want to be somewhat famous in michigan that is very specific <laughs> that's very specific chris interesting 
Aw. R.A. Bricks says, hi, happy Valentine's. Thank you, R.A. Bricks or Ra Bricks. And Adam says, I got two Legacy Ninjago 2021 sets and I got an Oni mini fig pack from Ninjago. I just want two spring Ninjago sets and some set for Christmas, so six. That's a pretty good, pretty good goal though. Not so bad. And Lord of the Bricks says, Sarah, it's... 25 minus 25 degrees here with the wind chill. Illinois is being insane right now. Mm. That's very cold. Midnight Mox says we had over 10 inches of snow in Seattle this past weekend. Closed the city down for a bit. I was living outside of Seattle before I moved here to the Netherlands. But I didn't see any snow while I lived there. It's definitely been a snowy, snowy time this year for for a lot of people. Robricks likes the flowers. Thank you, Robricks. They have not been the most fun to build, but they do look very pretty. And thank you for enjoying the way that they look. Mr. Soros says it's 12 degrees in Austin, Texas. There's snow everywhere, and I hate it. My southern heart can't take it. <laughs> hmm. oh, I don't blame you for that one. That's cold for Texas. Like, really cold. You need more views, says Robricks. No, there's plenty of views. Thank you, though. There's a pretty good amount of people here. Dean says, I don't think I could go one month without buying five sets. I mean, I already bought one during the stream. <laughs> That's true. And a cool one, too. You have a lot of cool Lego, Dean. Lord of the Bricks says, Aw, Ross, try and stay warm down there. I know y'all are not used to the snow. Take care of one another. Rob Bricks wants to know, is it hard to build the flowers? Some of them are a little bit stressful. The details are just really small. How have you been feeling about building these ones? Uh, yeah, it's pretty frustrating to build them. Uh, it's very flimsy. This this one was really, really finicky. You have to be really gentle, but you need to click it and push it in properly. And uh, yeah, a little bit stressful. Not relaxing. Don't recommend the set for the uh, casual Lego for the fan. Casual Lego builder that just wants to zen build. Yeah, it wasn't the most relaxing thing to build. I guess maybe if you do it really slowly, but some of the pieces just kind of seem to want to come off, and it's definitely not the most relaxing build. Zebrick says it's currently 25 degrees in Abu Dhabi. Wow. It's cold everywhere. Nice and warm. And uh, Lord of the Bricks says, I have a lot of family in Texas and they are hating the snow. I told them it's a lot better than ice and negative temperatures with wind chill. Yeah, it's all relative, I guess. Since my parents are in Florida, they hate the cold. And every time it gets even a little tiny bit cold, they're like really unhappy. <laughs> So it's, it's very relative. It must be horrible for people who are used to living in the warm climates. Adam says, I, I have this isn't bin with sets I broke when I was little that has been sorted and then I have my sorted bins. And Brick Tube Dave says, this year I got eight sets. I'm planning to get the blacksmith. Oh wait, this year I got eight sets this year. I'm planning to get the Blacksmith, UCS Gunship, Speed Champions, and more. Hmm. Uh, Robrick says, who is the boy? <laughs> Do you mean this one? Well, I'm Sarah. Which boy? I think you. I mean? I'm Sarah and... Uh, I think I'm Mike. You I'm think? Mike. I'm Mike. Right? <laughs> I'm sorry, this is these flowers, man. I'm Mike. I'm, I'm definitely Mike. <laughs> Oh, man. And uh, we do Lego live streaming on this channel, which is my channel, the Sarah Starbricks channel. We usually build Lego and chat calmly with people, but this has been a very stressful stream with these flowers. Oh, yeah. My heart rate is like a <sighs> chain, man. Really? Yeah. From the flowers? Yeah. Maybe that's why I started feeling a pain in my chest, too. It was a little bit stressful building these. 
Robrix has to go. Bye, Robrix. Thanks so much for stopping by, Robrix. Yeah. Woodshop teacher says, spent quite some time on Bricklink today. Needed to stock up on parts for sig figs. Oh, cool. I still want to trade you a sig fig when I make one. I have to make a sig fig. It's like, that's got to be one of my goals going back to what Chris was asking. Like, what are your, your goals this year? I've definitely got to make a sig fig. Bye, Robrix. Yeah. Thanks for coming by. Have you a good set one. yourself a deadline. Yeah. I like to be spontaneous and in the moment, though. <laughs> uh, JT Studio says, a few days ago, I actually got my mom to buy this set because she was getting mad that the flowers kept dying. Yeah, Lego flowers are forever, which is really cool. And I'm interested to know, like, if they're going to do other bouquets. Do you think there's going to be a different bouquet every year, but with different arranged flowers, different colors? They could do, like, all different flower packs. Yeah, but they could also just do another bouquet as well with totally different stuff. Oh, this looks cool. Maybe I would have wanted to build this one, but it's okay. It's kind of neat. <laughs> um, the Zoom is here. Hi, hey, Chris. Chris. Welcome. Thanks for coming by. That's a lot of Chris's today. I like how Lord of the Bricks is still here. He said he was going to go shovel snow. He says, I've lived in Illinois my entire life. I don't know why I'm still here. <laughs> yeah. I was in Ohio. That's where my family is mostly from, is from Ohio, but... I've moved all my life every every couple years because I'm an army brat. So I've lived a little bit of everywhere in the U.S. Never lived in Illinois, though. But I feel like Ohio is kind of, like, comparable weather-wise. Hope you're doing good, Chris. Nice and, uh... Yeah, I was going to say, if the Zoom also streams on Mondays, Messy Monday, in just a few hours, so be sure to check that out if you're interested. Anna says, should the set come with a warning? May cause chest pain? I think it probably should. It's stressful. Gosh. I don't know. Building these flowers. Maybe it's something we ate or something. Do you really feel chest pain yeah, as well? I feel, definitely feel chest pain. Yeah, yeah I, I feel told, like tight here. Yeah, I felt like that too a little bit ago. <laughs> oh man, Lord of the Bricks says, "Mike, you're looking great with those flowers, mate." The flowers are nice. Yeah, I'm pretty sad, you guys, because I brought it up uh, yesterday. Actually, me and Mr. Starbricks went to a really nice restaurant for Valentine's Day a few years ago. And they had a special area where you could go down and take pictures. And there, they had a professional photographer taking, like, couples photos. And I had somewhere I even posed, like, with flowers and stuff. They were nice pictures. And they were supposed to email you the pictures after your dinner. And they never emailed them. I never got them. I'm so sad. We emailed the restaurant. Mike tried to track down, like, who took the pictures and how to get in contact with these people to get these special Valentine's Day Three photos. Later, the restaurant shut down. <laughs> I'm so sad. I just... <laughs> Valentine's Day now makes me think about that, how I had these special pictures taken for memories, and they're just gone forever. I, I sure wish that they had emailed those photos. They were nice. Bricktube Dave says, I'm... Um... Um... <clears throat> A certain age. When I'm older, I want to move to Michigan, Florida, or Arizona. Not for the weather, but for the price. Wow, Brick Tube Dave has it planned out. Oh, that looks pretty. Ah, it's done. <laughs> Gonna pop that in there. Tulips. I think we'll take a break from doing the flowers Roses. now. These are pretty nice. Okay. They need to range a little bit, but you guys can kind of get the general like I said, idea. Yeah. We have a few other roses as well, but let's not show those, please. Oh, boy. Yeah. My knife. I need to arrange them a little bit, but yeah. <laughs> uh, 
Let's see, let's see. Thomas says it's 22 below zero over here. And geez, it's cold. My grandma's car will not start. And now it's tomorrow we don't have school because of snow. Aww. <laughs> I, I noticed to Nate, he says, uh, Lord of the Bricks says, Sarah, I don't want to go outside. Because a while ago he said he was leaving and he's still here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't want to go outside either. But luckily it's nighttime here and we don't have to go anywhere, at least today. Adamo is eating a sandwich. But it's a special sandwich, not normal. How is it special, Adam? I'm I'm intrigued now. Tell me how. Tell Can me about your special sandwich. Building, uh, well, it's not actually a joke because I don't actually do stickers, so I don't know the pain about stickers. I never do stickers. No, stickers is better than this, though. Yeah, but that's what's I... my joke. Like, can we just go back to a set with eighty thousand stickers? But then only I feel the pain. That, that, that's why I help, withheld my joke. <sighs> it is less painful, though, to do stickers than this, though. I mean, depends, but yeah. Dean says, take some new pictures with the Lego flowers. Yeah, that's a good idea. But they were nice Valentine's Day pictures, though. Pretty sad. Brickham's Den says, Sarah Starbricks, gotta run. Nice seeing you again and catch you next time. All right, bye, Brickham's Den. Thanks for coming by. And Midnight Mox says, It was years ago when they issued a state of emergency in Illinois, minus 40 degrees. Wow, that's crazy. Um, oh, Adam O's sandwich has chicken in it. And he likes to call that special. That does sound pretty special, chicken Adam. Sandwich. Sounds delicious. I'm looking forward to my special tacos in a little bit. Do you want special tacos? Ah, uh, yeah, tacos. I like tacos. And it is Tuesday, right? No way, it's Monday. But it's Tuesday in Australia, so it can be Taco Tuesday here. Because it is Tuesday in Australia. So it can be our Taco Tuesday. And Brickham's Den is going to see Fazoom later on Fazoom stream. That's awesome. That's good. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Good going. Hmm? There's something on the phone. Let's take a quick peek at the Lego rooms. Ah, oh, I'm glad we're done building those flowers now. Whew. Apparently you can vote on the Lego Ideas We Love Sports Fan Vote and the winner could be turned to a Lego Ideas set. Wow. My hair is just all kinds of weird today. Uh, they're pretty cool builds. And if you're in a certain area, where's Meyer again? <laughs> Nate is uh, procrastinating going outside, which I do not blame him for at all. He says he's got his boots on, but he hasn't grabbed his coat yet. Where, yeah. Where, where's Meyer grocery chain again? Mm, kind of in the, like, in Ohio, Michigan area. Why? Who's talking about Meyer? Lego video sets already available at Meyer. Wow, that's cool. Uh, how much snow do you have to shovel, Nate? Is it a lot, or is it just like a driveway? Just a hair globe dryer. It will all go away. I don't think Mr. Starbricks has ever shoveled snow before. But I definitely have shoveled snow it's quite a lot. It's balcony. I just, I just let the sun take care of it. Well, it's different when you have to drive out of your driveway. Yeah, but I don't have a car. Yeah, I know. But I'm just saying, you have to shovel the snow if you have pets or if you have to, like, drive. Then you can't just let it melt. You have to, you have to shovel it. But, yeah. Oh, that's awesome, BrickTube Dave. He says that he subbed to Lord of the Bricks. Wonderful. Dean says, build a city set to help you relax. Or the little tuk-tuk. Yeah, we did build the little tuk-tuk, actually, Dean. I think we built that on the eight-hour live stream that I did a couple of weeks ago. So we did build that, and it was nice to build those ones. I'm not really sure what we have that's kind of relaxing to build. Brick I think I have something relaxing. 
next thing to build. I'm just gonna hold it up to Sarah. She can decide if she wants to build it or not. It's not that Harry Potter book, is it? No, that's not. Okay, that. good. Because <laughs> I don't want to build that Harry Potter book right now. Oh yeah, I'm down for one of these. Either one. You pick. We can let the audience choose if they want to. I'm gonna move the flowers a little bit forward though. We'll build something else and hang out for a little bit longer with you guys. It's a slow evening today. Also, I'm not sure where my tweezers are. I may have left them on the table. Your tweezers, I see them. Yeah. It's so weird. Sometimes we have like a very low amount of number of people on Mondays, and sometimes there's a huge number of people on Mondays. So it's, should it's, we build the little camper? Oh, there's only or, 18 people here? Yeah, that's what I'm saying is sometimes there's like 50 people in here and sometimes it's very low. Why do you only leave people? Were we not boring? Were we boring? No, it's fine. And it's all, a it's a, especially in the US, it's a, a holiday, right? So yeah, you, it's you President's enjoy Day. enjoy day off instead of just chillaxing on the couch after a busy day work. Lord of the Bricks says that he has to shovel probably a good six inches. Not that bad. Oh, still six inches of snow. That's quite a lot, Nate. And even if just one person would be watching, we would still be streaming. Thomas says, everybody take care. Bye, Sarah. Bye, Mike. Bye, everyone. Bye, Thomas. Thanks for hanging with us. Adam wants us to do the camper. Midnight Mock says camper. Camper. Or camper or tractor? This is the camper. Let us know. Nobody likes the farm sets. This comes with a cute bunny. I like both. Lord of the Bricks says, I'm actually closer to the West Country. One down in St. Louis area. I think that might be... Tractor, anybody? Oh, yeah. And he also said, I'm just going to shovel a footpath from my back door to the garage. But see, oh, when you yeah. walk in and out of your house, you have to shovel. Yeah. Otherwise, you're going to have to walk through snow everywhere you go. So you have to shovel when you live in a place like that. Lego Mike votes for Tractor. Camper, Adam, Ingrid says camper. I think we are probably going to do the camper. It's been a tough day. Today. Let's do the camper. Yes. Camper, camper it is. And Sorry, this, Mike. <laughs> this one also has a baby in it, which is really cool. Yeah, there's a funny story about this, right? Yeah, I, I, at least they, re they posted online that it's the same family growing up throughout several different sets. I'm sure you guys have probably seen that mentioned before, but it's pretty cute. Woodshop teacher voted tractor as well. I love both. They're both cute. But we'll do the camper for now. <laughs> Adam says yes. Mr. Blue Toys is here. Hey, Nathan. Hi, Nathan. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Go. I like uh, I like Nate's idea. Lord of the Bricks says, Sarah, you could put the flowers in a clear vase and put translucent blue pieces in the bottom to represent the water. I do oh, like yeah. that. Unfortunately, I don't really have a lot of vases anymore. I used to have a bunch before I moved here, but I got rid of them all. Do you have a lot of uh, blue translucent studs? I do, actually. Yeah. Well, I have tiles. I don't know if I have studs, though. But I have tiles. You can always brick link that though. Build the camp. But yeah, it's so funny because I used to throw away vases like crazy because every time I got flowers, they give you a new vase. Ah, yes. So I used to get so many flowers that I had this huge giant collection of vases and then I got rid of them all before I moved here. I'm sorry for to Lego Mike and Wuchok teacher. We fought a hard battle, but the tractor <laughs> will be another time. Dean says he's built both of these. Which one did you like better, Dean? Are they nice? This looks pretty cute. I like I like Dean's suggestion to build like a a nice calm city set. So that's what we're doing on Dean's advice here. I like these sim simple city city builds. Just building just something a nice and relaxing. Or like a camper fan. It's just it's just it's fun. Yeah. This is cute. Here's a wrapper. <laughs> Thank you, Amazon Germany, for the discount. Thank you. Can we put the tractor wheels on the camper fan at least? <laughs> These big wheels. And Laura the Brick says that that's his idea, is putting the flowers on the kitchen table. But unfortunately, all he has is the tulips and roses. Is the bouquet sold out in, in the US? 
Maybe. Is it hard for you to get right now, Nate? It's also at other stores. Yeah, like if you... I was going to say, if you get really lucky, you can pick it up at Target. But you got to be fast because I know people restocking those shelves say that the stuff, when they put the new sets out, they just get bought right away. Mm-hmm. So... Mike wants to track her. So tra- I, I really, I, I was just playing around. I, 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 oh, it's a baby in a like, little turquoise. Like this is so cute. It's just, I know Sarah has been asking for a long time that she wants a farm theme to come back, like city yeah. farm. And this is kind of like one of the few farm related. There's a whole wave of farm stuff. I know. I really want farm stuff a lot. And now I'm feeling goats. like I should have gotten the village mill raid or the medieval market because I do want those goats. Look how cute this little cute. baby in turquoise is. Mm-hmm. That's but adorable. I think if I had to pick between the tractor and the camper fan, Aww. I think. The lady carries the little baby. That's adorable. I think I'm going to go with the, the, the van because it has like a, a playability. You can open it up, see? So it's open and they can sleep at the top. <laughs> Lord of the Bricks says, oh, all right, I'm going to leave now. Okay. Wish me luck. Good luck, Nate. You can do it. Good luck. And Crazy Tivity is here. Hi, Crazy Tivity. Hudenavend. Hudenavend. And Midnight Mock says, the bouquet has been sold out since day one here. Valentine's Day hype, too. Aw, that's unfortunate, Midnight Mocks. Cut the Craggle is back and says, what did I miss? Uh, just the frustration of building these flowers, Cut the Craggle. So we finished the bouquet, which is over here. It's not arranged, but it's just caused both of us to have chest pains and anxiety. It was it's not so, very fun it's, building it's that so thing. It's so intricate, so flimsy. Like putting this on top of the stems, you're like slipping and don't want to break it. It was not a very fun build experience, but the flowers do look really pretty after they're done, though. This does not give me a zen moment. It did not. But it's uh, it looks nice when it's done. Sometimes sets just are better when they're finished than the actual build. Well, this lady has some interesting hair. I'm not sure how I'm feeling about it. It kind of reminds me of like an old haircut that my mom had that I hated when she had short hair, because she looks a lot better with long hair. And a few minutes ago, we weird hair. started to build this camper van so we can uh, squeeze that in here. And I wonder if my parents have ever watched the live stream. Maybe they have. Do you think so, though? I'm sure they clicked on it at least once. Do you think so, though, really? Or are you just saying that to be nice? Do you really think they've ever clicked on it? I hope so. But my do you, mom do you, one Do time. you think that they have, though? Like, if you have to guess... Then why did you say you think they probably well, at least clicked I want on to it? Think the best of people, right? I'm sure they're like, like uh, let's see what, what they're up to on the other side of the world. I've sent them my YouTube channel before, but I don't know if they've ever come by. I would think if they did that they would say something, but you never know, I guess. Yeah, crazy tippity, you you missed a build. I would um, hope that they would say that they came by. There's two bags in the camper and in the tractor. Both are two bags, by the way. Uh, and yeah, yeah, cut the cut, crag- yeah. Oh, sorry. sorry. Cut the craggle says, I thought flowers were meant to be relaxing. Yeah, you would think, but I guess they're just more relaxing to look at than they were to actually build them. Yeah. So now we're trying to relax by, I'm going to say slowly building this um, this camper set. I'm, I'm trying to think why that is. Why what is? These flowers. I, I think for me, the big problem with this is there is no stability. You're not putting it on a building. You don't have a frame or a sculpture. It's just... And these shapes of these flowers, you can't put it on the table and then put the next piece on. You really have to like hold it because if you do it, you will break the whole flower. I think that's my problem. These were the easiest because these easiest you can lay flat on the table. I always really love when they put a fried egg in a set. And also for those of you who are just joining now, we're now transitioned to building yes. the the camper van. This came out this year or in 2020? And this is a new set. 2021? This is a 2021 Six. city set. 60283 the official lego set <laughs> 60283 the camper is that what's camper called camper van, van? Yes, camper van. i always like these i don't know how many pieces is in it 300 400 something it's pretty cute adam says thanks mike i have been dying to see how many bags is in this set so we have we have two bags this yeah. is bag two this is bag one 
just a small little build mm -hmm. and I'm sure you guys are all used to us building these ridiculously large multi-stream sets yes this is a new one. yeah it is new I just didn't know if it was from 2020 or if it's a 2021 set but I guess it is a 2021 set thank you doc yeah, we got these like a month and a half ago when they were on discount already on Amazon Germany. Lego Man says it was just called the Camper Van. Yep. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Want to build a little on it? The old one had a canoe on the roof. Do we have another Camper Van? Yeah, we have one of the first ones. I think actually in 20... Mm -hmm. I. Th Are you confused about what I'm doing? No, no. Or did I do we... something wrong? Actually, I think maybe... Did I do something wrong here? Did I forget the red thing right here on the front? Sorry, I think I forgot a piece. If you flip it around again, yeah, I think you have to put this red one in there. Sorry. But um, I think we actually got a camper van in 2017 when I first got back into buying Lego. I think we have a camper van from that time, but I don't really... I think we have one. Yeah, it like opens up. I'm imagining it now, and it has a little coffee machine inside of it. It was one of the first sets that I got when I was getting back into Lego again. Cut the Craggle says, I should be working on a new video, but I'm so tired after work and dinner has made me even more sleepy. I guess he's carving out. That did works. you en did you enjoy the roast? I hope so. Adam says, I have the one with a blue car and a trailer, but not the old camper. I thought that the one that I had had like a blue truck. I think mine has a blue vehicle as well, Adam. It's been a few years since I've seen this. Mm -hmm. It's probably in a crate somewhere. Yeah, I think it's actually in the crate underneath us right now. There's like a Sorry. crate full of Lego stuff down here. But yeah. Lego everywhere. Lego Madness says I have that one too. I, I especially like the food trucks. The food trucks, I think, is also Sarah's. We like getting all the food trucks because we like food. And then you have a pizza van, and we have a... Uh, but we didn't get the King Pixie, so... This is the Deluxe Camper Van. Oh, it's okay. actually called a Caravan on these stickers. It says Caravan Deluxe, so that's pretty fancy. Have you ever stayed in a caravan before? Uh, like camper. a camper? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember those stories that my parents were telling about their camping adventures. Mm -hmm. We used to go camping with my parents a lot and stay in campers. And like motor homes and stuff like that. And I've also, when my grandparents took me and my sister to Disney World when we were little, I think I was like 10 years old when they took us to Disney World and they drove us around Florida in their motor home. Because at the time, my grandpa and grandma had a big giant motor home. I think you've seen some of their newer motor homes now when we've gone by their shop. They have those big motor homes oh. in the front parking. But they used to drive us around in the motor home and they took us to Disney World. That's cool. Yeah. I'm not a big fan of staying in the campers. It can be kind of fun, but... Never done that before. Mm. And, uh... <laughs> Cut the Craggle says that the roast was beautiful. Mmm. That's good. Yes. I'm definitely looking forward to our uh, leftover tacos today. Because I do like yeah. tacos. Wow, you're fast. Fun too. Nicely done. Yeah, the tacos, at least they will be they will be quick. I do need to turn the oven on. I think it's already time for that. Go for it. It's 15 minutes or so. so. No worries. Oh, this one also has a little coffee machine, by the way. And the coffee mug in this camper slash caravan is actually pink. So that's pretty cute. Pretty darn cute. You okay? Did you crack something? Ah. Uh. When you bent over, did something I, crack? Yeah, that I sounded... Popped my, I popped my right knee. I'm getting old. Oh, be careful. The uh, inactivity is uh, making my knee joints a little bit... Uh... Ow. It's okay. There's like a soda pop sitting here on their little table. You know what this makes me think of? Honestly, it makes me think of the travel couple that we like to watch, I which I won't I won't specifically mention because I don't want to like date our channel with like random like references because you never know what's going to happen. But you know who I'm talking about, though. Like we have this travel couple that we really enjoyed following and then they changed their trajectory because of the situation in the world. They decided to start uh, 
modding a van and driving around the U.S. And this reminds me of that couple. Yes. You were thinking it as well? I was thinking it as well. I'm glad to know that I'm not, like, when I'm putting this in here, I'm just like, and this is where they would have their coffee. <laughs> <laughs> this is where they're going to work when they're editing their videos. <laughs> mm -hmm. I was totally thinking about them. That's so funny. But I don't want to specifically mention who it is. Lego Madness is getting this soon as well. Oh, that's awesome, Lego Madness. Which up teacher says, that's on my bucket list to rent a motorhome and go north to show the kids the North Cape. The end of Europe. Wow, that's cool. That sounds fun. Invite me for that woodshop teacher because I'm all down. The way <laughs> through Denmark and then up to Sweden and then to Norway. So. Doesn't that sound like a super fun vacation? I would totally go on a motorhome trip with the woodshop teacher. That sounds super fun. It is fun to go on road trips. So you can like stop at random places and eat random things and you eat in the motorhome. That's fun. You want to make an appearance? Oh, she does not sound happy. She does not sound happy about that at all. Voice your displeasure. <laughs> the people could hear you. Yeah, they could definitely hear that. Paris is not happy. You okay? She's like, I want food. But there is food in your bowl. But that's not her proper food. That's that Lily's Kitchen that she won't eat anymore because we're out of the other oh, food. Oh, we have it tomorrow. It's, it's coming tomorrow. She's unhappy. Like 20 cans or something. She wants her proper food. I hope she eats that new stuff. 10th of April. And then you get Wagyu beef. But yeah, look, this is where they edit their videos. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's funny. Yes, I heard meow. Says Adam. Yeah, Adam, you definitely heard Paris. Lego Mike is like, wow, Paris. <laughs> <laughs> She's just hungry. Come here. If you bring her the treats, she can come on the table. Which one? The satisfactions? Yeah, but she can only have like one because she has to take her pill in a little bit too. Her medicine. Come here. Here, we're going to do trick time. It's trick time. Come here. Come up here. Yep, that's Uno. You want Maduro. one? No, Bushy has it. No, I don't have any. Bushy has it. <laughs> Although, I think maybe we should move the flowers. I'll move the flowers. All right. There you go. No, this is flowers. <laughs> it's right here, you dork. Sit. High five. Give me a nice high five. Yes. <laughs> it's more like grabbing me because she's getting a little aggressive. Ew. She's making a big mess. All right. Sit. Sit pretty. No, just sit. No. <laughs> that meow was so loud, the neighbor's dog started barking. She's hey. making a big mess, though. I think I mean, you should take this away now. There's more. <gasps> eat, eat more. <laughs> Paris. No, oh, I think she just wants her normal food. I'm sorry. Your new food, huh? Your hills. <sighs> I'm sorry, it's old. And you didn't like the other one. We have to send that one back. The Royal Canyon, huh? Now my hands kind of smell like cat oh, treats. Oh, Paris! What? You, you spilled the egg. <laughs> I have nothing. Aw, what does And you does already have whipped cream, so... She probably wants more whipped cream. Yes. <laughs> I know, life is hard. <laughs> you want to tell on to the people what, what Bossy did yesterday to you? The pain? She needed to have a bath. And she's not cleaning herself anymore, so we had to like wash her. And it looked really sad when she tried to escape out of the sink. <laughs> she climbed all the she way out like my arm. She's like Sarah, like, ah, no, I don't want this. Aww. But she yeah, are you going to eat your treats? You're such a good cat. You're such a good kitty. You can sit on the chair for a little bit if you want. <laughs> Aww. You can hear her purring. That's cool. Really? Aww, that's cool. Yeah, you're a good cat, huh? Yeah. Hi, Samad. Samad Salami's here. Hey, Samad. Thanks for coming by. Let's see if I can get you anything. Huh? I feel bad touching the Lego now because my hands kind of smell like cat treats. These are just treats. 
I don't think she has anything else that she can have, though. Um, no. She's getting excited like there's something for her, but there's just not. You're I'm not sorry, Pierce. Don't chicken nuggets, but you don't want chicken. I'm sorry, Pierce. You can sit on my lap. Yeah, let me get this. Yeah, Let's thanks. It's kind of dirty. You want some of the rest of the treat? Is she eating it? kind of eating it. Mr. Blue Toy says, Sarah, did you get any candy for Valentine's Day? I did, actually. I got a giant box of 100 Tony's Choco Lonely Chocolates. So it's like a whole bunch of different flavors of chocolate. They're like little uh, chocolate bites. And they're already all gone. No, they're <laughs> not. They're on the table over there. Uh, this is actually a Dutch brand of like... I don't know. They, they... There's like hazelnut and sea salt and dark chocolate and white chocolate and milk chocolate. I don't and know if you've ever seen this brand, but it's supposed raspberry. to be like a, like a fair trade oh. type of chocolate. Nate, are you okay? He says, oh, it's so cold. Did you already shovel? That was fast. Wow. Oh. That's the chocolate box. That's not for you. <laughs> Poor cat. But yet, I, I'm not ex expecting anybody to know this brand. No, probably not. I like this one. Yeah, we had an empty one. This is sealed, but empty. Adam is like, Paris, take Mike's seat. You want to sit? No. She's really upset. Oh, what, is up? what can I do? I don't know. Hey. Do you want to build the rest of this? Yeah. Or open up another bag? Oh, yeah, I have your bag too. My yeah. hand kind of smells like cat treats. Mr. Blue Toys has an emoji, and Lord of the Bricks is almost done with the shoveling. Huh? Adam says, I heard a loud meow. Yeah, she wants something, but I'm not sure what. Midnight Mox says, oh, hi, Paris. I'm sorry, it's, it's all... It's oh, cool. Lord of the Bricks sent me a picture on Discord of the snow. Let me take a look. It's coming tomorrow. Let me take a look, Nate. We have more cans coming for you tomorrow. Oh my. And the Wagyu deal isn't until April. Look at all that Ooh. snow. <laughs> that's Lord of the Bricks white. snow. Yeah, it's just a... It's just... Oh, uh, that's a snow. lot of snow. Oh my gosh. I have to build this for a little bit, Paris. Is this your neighbor's house, Nate? Or is this your house with the hearts on the door? Someone has like little hearts all oh, over their door. Cute. That's pretty cute. I don't know if that's your neighbor or if that's your house. I guess it's probably the neighbor because this looks like his house that he's coming out of, like his garage. I like your neighbor's hearts. That's cute. Very right. cute, but very snowy. Very snowy. Hey, you want to put a sticker on? Samad says, I love it when cats meow, but when they sound sad, I get a little concerned. Yeah. She's just, she got sick a few weeks ago, so she's still a little weird, you know? She's not normal. Um, so I have to keep an eye on her and make sure that things get better and not worse. But she she's eat? trying. Why don't you try to eat some of that food? That was your favorite. Every single day, you would be crying, I want Lily's Kitchen. Well, that ch the chicken one is actually the one she didn't really like that much. Okay. She always liked the lamb one before, but... Yeah, remember your lamby or Hunter's Hotspot? <laughs> that was like your favorite food. Adam says, sorry, Paris. Aw, that's nice, Adam. Thank you. You want to sit? You want me out of your chair? And Crazy Tivity had said that's a Tony's package that he's never seen before. Uh, yeah, yeah so they have all these little chocolates inside. Yeah, so these are, you have the bars. Maybe you can grab me one and I'll open yeah. it and I'll eat one. You can get one for yourself as well Which if you want, want to. I, ooh, I kind of want the pink one, but I also want a chocolate one, so I don't know. I'm not sure. Not a milk chocolate one, though. Uh, like a green one. Just yeah, one. just grab a variety. So we have, like, there's a whole pile of, like, a hundred of these, and there's all these different flavors. So normally they're bars, which... It tastes really good, but the problem with the bars is it's really hard to break the bar because they have a really weird pattern on them. I like them. But these are the tinies, and uh, I think I ordered them directly from them. Which kind do you want? 
I don't know, whichever you don't want. I could have hazelnut or white raspberry. Hi, Paris. Hmm. Aw, you okay? Poor girl. Oh, 80s is here. I actually saw Lego Mike's comment saying, hey, K-pop, and then I knew 80s was here already. Hi, 80s. Hey, 80s. Lego Mike wants to know if I've tried hand feeding her food. Yeah, sometimes, sometimes I do. She was eating this, um, it's like a kidney care food, and she was eating that, but we ran out of it today, so she's waiting for more food that yeah. she was actually willing to eat. I ordered a few days eat. ago, but it's not coming until tomorrow, unfortunately for her. Yeah. We only have a, a decent supply of 20 or 30 cans. We oh. had more, but she didn't like it. Lego Loser is here. Hey, Lego hey, Loser. Lego Loser Productions. Welcome. But yeah, that I meant to show you guys, but it's like these little chocolates inside. This one's hazelnut. <laughs> Sarah was like, oh, I never get a big box of chocolates. Well, here's a hundred. There you go. You didn't want to just get them for me just because? No, I wanted to get them for oh, you. Oh, the way you said it sounded not nice. No, I mean like... You were like, I always say that I never no, get chocolates. Not that like not I nice. always have to be misconstrued. I wanted you to have some nice Because you said something not nice first, and then you said you bought I them for me. I wanted you to have chocolates, and I wanted you to have flowers. Mm -hmm. Thank you. My pleasure. Want a chocolate? Yeah, I'll get some. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Edie. She says she really wants chocolate. Oh, but you didn't need one about you. Come here. Come here, babe. Yeah, come up. Poor girl. Jump up here. You're always welcome. Come up, kitty. Yep, there you go. Nail <laughs> in my leg. Aw, it's just chocolate. It's not for you. It's a chocolate, you You're a good girl. Want Poor kitty. This is a Lego. Aww. This is a Lego brick. Poor Paris. Open up, Paris. Look, it's open up. That's you, cute. You want to go on a camping fan adventure? You go on, a, on an adventure ride? Well, she doesn't like the word adventure, though. No. Time <laughs> Last time she went on an adventure, that was to the vet. No adventure. Don't worry, Paris. You're a good girl. You're so beautiful and smart. You have to give positive encouragement, says Sarah always. And yeah. I think it helps. Yeah, it does, right? If you tell bad things to your cat, then they're like... You're beautiful. Mm -hmm. You're so pretty. And you're smart. And you're special. You do good tricks. Oh, look how beautiful. So dapper. How beautiful. Wow. You're very pretty. Yes, she likes this a lot. You're like, pretty. Yeah. <laughs> I like how she's just kind of overseeing the Lego building. We're almost done. And uh, hopefully we can find you something. AD says that she rearranged her K-pop shelf. Hey, maybe she wants more cheeseburger. Oh, Maybe yeah. that's what she's interested in because yesterday we got some takeout and for lunch we got cheeseburgers and Paris really likes cheeseburger so she had some cheeseburger and she is she was really enjoying that quite a lot. Oh yeah, the cheeseburger. Maybe she wants more cheeseburger. She went nuts for it. She was in kitty heaven. Cheese and burger. She likes the pieces with the cheese on it more. No, this is chocolate. <laughs> it's, it's chocolate. You can't have it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't be disappointed. Oh, Paris is back. She thought it was something for her. Now she's like, I'm out of here. You want to sit? Share this chair? Let's share the chair. She's like, she's going to jump down. She's like, nah, I'm out. Want to share the chair? Careful. Oh, she's got it. <laughs> she's, she's still spry enough to jump up and down the chair. <laughs> oh, Paris, you're a mascot. You're part of the channel. Nicoletta says, Sarah Starbreaks, you're building the city camper van. I like this Lego city van. Yeah, it's nice. I'm glad that you like it as well. Oh, Mahan came back. 
Sarah had like cat treats and now she's eating chocolate with cat treat sands. How do they taste? Is it extra special? <laughs> It was that? mostly in the wrapper though when oh, I take it out and then I use this hand. This is my cat treat hand. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. I like these ones, it's kind of like Pop Rocks. Yeah, this one has Pop Rocks in it. Yeah. This mm. is the, the Kinetar Shaker. <laughs> Kinetar Shaker. It's fun, but you have to try not to like crunch it up too much. If you just like let it melt a little bit, then the Pop Rocks go off more. Yeah, I don't know if they have a uh, Tony's chocolate only in other countries except for Belgium. I think it's a Dutch thing. I don't know if they're importing, exporting it already. Don't you think just see this at the Starbucks or something? Samad Salami hurt his hand. Oh, what's I'm sorry, Samad. What happened there? He says he slammed it in his door. Aw, oh, Samad, ouch. That sounds painful. That's always like one of the most painful things you can do is slam your finger in a door. Ow. Ow. I hope it heals quickly. Just don't want to build some of this? Uh, no, it's okay. You can go for it. You can it's do better, stickers. Better to ask, otherwise it will be built. Nah, it's okay. Go for it. And Brick Fella is here too. Hi, Brick Fella. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for coming by. Mm -hmm. She's a little bit weird today. Yeah, I don't know what's up with her. Poor Paris. She's getting off that cheese boogler high. She wants some more cheese cheese boogler. My people won't stay standing. There's nothing over a few times. I know she did. You're spicy, huh? Are you a spicy cat? <laughs> spicy Nako? Yep. Paris? Hey, Paris. Yeah. You're smart. <laughs> she responds to her name. Of course she does. She knows her name. You want a super chat, Paris? Oh yeah, I forgot to check out the stream. Oh time. yeah. We gotta test that to out. To see if it works. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Nicoletta says that she likes Brixish's YouTube channel. Yeah, Brixish has a really awesome YouTube. Oh, so you man, should check it out. Some of those stop motion with a spaceman. With the music. Those were so catchy. And uh, Lego Loser Productions points out matching your chairs again. Yes. I I guess it's just that's the clothes and colors that we generally like. Oh, that was fast. Yeah. And I still have to do the stickers, of course. Yep. Although, what's going on here? Hmm? I didn't. Looks pretty wonky, if you ask me. Wow, this is really wonky. Oh, okay. Oh, I didn't click it out properly. I guess not. Here we go. I think it's good now. All right. I think it's better to, for you to put the stickers on without the wheels. Okay. Can you uh, click on the link so I have the link? What? What link? The Streamlabs URL. Which button is that? The leftmost one. In oh, the... yeah. I see it now. Like this? Yes. So we're going to test something out in the chat. This is actually a way to directly donate to the channel. So please feel free to ignore it for now. Uh, Mr. Starbricks just wants to test it out to see how it works. Yeah, because uh, the YouTube Super Chat system and Super Sticker system they take is one a, way. Yeah, exactly. And this is another way that you can choose to donate that takes less of a percentage than YouTube does if you want. It's also in case Sarah everything. ever would do game streaming on Twitch, then, you know, then we have... Oh, Twitch can I use this for that as well? Yeah, if you use Streamlabs, then you don't have to rely on YouTube, so... I guess that makes try sense. This out. The website loads. Let me take a look at these stickers while you're doing that. So, I think it's one on the front. Sarah, do you accept friend requests on Discord? I do, Samad. I'm surprised that we're not already friends on there. 
we should be. Um, I think this is kind of like pretty low down, I guess. They asked me to put my PayPal in. All right, I'll try my PayPal. We'll see if it works. Wow, how much are you going to give me, Mr. Starbricks? <laughs> Oh, that was fast. Whoa, Mr. Starbricks, although your name is all messed up, donated $5. Wow, that's pretty cool, right? All right, it seems to work. That's the neat. The has been processed. Cool. That's pretty Get fun. Prime to Gift Prime. Thank you. Buy yourself Streamlabs Prime, <laughs> and Sarah Starbricks will get one month for free. Wow. No, nope. That's nice. Thank you. Like a loser says, uh... Oh, the goat list. Uh, Family Bricks just showed up, and he wants to know that what is the board behind. So this is actually the goat list, which this is. It's a letter board. A very large letter board, and it's. Hold on, hold on. Oh, hold it. Some of the people who have donated so far to the channel. Um, through super stickers, super chats, or now I guess Streamlabs donation as well. We just started doing this on last week, a week ago, yeah, on Monday, and this is already the huge amount of people who've decided to donate to the channel, which is really nice. Super chats and super stickers. Now we have to add Cafe Corner to this, and we also need to add Little Bins and Bricks who donated on yeah. Thursday. The only problem is we kind of ran out of some common letters, so we need to buy. We have to buy more letters. letters. And uh, we, we don't know how this is going to go over time because it will fill up. Put but it. Uh, we have other other things planned for also putting up constellations for donators as well. Yeah, We're going to the dark stickers that go on decorating the with stars and write the name of everybody on there. We uh, we ordered two hundred glow in the dark stars and we're waiting for them to show up. I think Thursday. Just uh, you know, other channels are doing it too. It's just something to uh, make it a little more everybody. fun, yeah, and give people a little bit of credit. So, Mr. Starbricks is so generous. If only he was here. <laughs> yeah. So what we're also trying to figure out is the Streamlabs like cut slash PayPal cut. Yeah. So, uh, so it's a little more advantageous if you want it more so directly to go to me. But I'm also okay if that's not your preference because i don't mind giving youtube something for basically hosting I so mean, much YouTube is so our home. No, yeah. it is uh, a personal choice if you even choose to do that at all which is not required at all mm -hmm. and there's i feel a little bit bad because there are some other people that maybe will be added to the goat list potentially for for donating for helping Paris out, which was really greatly appreciated, yeah. but it was before we were doing super chats and super stickers, so. Yeah, this does not contain anybody who donated for Paris. We, uh, which we was very appreciated. I don't know if Sarah wants to like do that, but we, we that was. We figure out a way to honor those really, people as well. Really, really generous that was, and really appreciated. Yeah, I mean, that's way more, you know, just so much This is super nice and me. this will help the channel going but we're good paris those bills were not fun no and it definitely helped us out in a in a mad pickle so yeah thank you, you can so see much. paris is still here and thanks to all the help and uh, that's something i i don't think i'll ever forget that generosity there yeah same to everybody who helped out even small amounts and even some large amounts so it's, it's uh, yeah. i don't know how is this looking to you does this look okay i think the one on the front looks pretty good but I'm not sure how I feel about these. Maybe I should have put it lower. Looks good. I didn't fully center them because I thought that it might look better higher up, but now it, it looks kind of looks weird to I me. I think you, you still need to put the license plates on. Yeah. Hey, Aaron Kaplan saying hi, Sarah. Hi, Aaron. Uh, so Brickfella, yeah, the Streamlabs, uh, no, sorry, yeah, it's Streamlabs link is active. It should yeah. work, as you saw. I, I donated to Sarah. I. We just have to see if that donation through Streamlabs. I think it will just sit there in Streamlabs until Sarah claims it. Claims it. I don't know if you have your phone. Do you have your phone? Do you see that instantly? See it where? Like, do you get a PayPal notification? Like, no, no, online? that would be through my email. So I have to log into that. Because I, I had got a PayPal notification as well. Then you paid five dollars. But yeah, you can do that. Wow. So uh, we just wanted to try that out on the stream, also with the, uh, uh, with the. Uh, 
the pop-up so that's similar so if it's anybody donates to youtube or Streamlabs, it will have is the star. there a back license plate i think it was on this one actually oh okay maybe i can Let's see and, and yeah laura the bricks you, you are actually uh, you you donated to paris and also the super chat it's yeah. you have no idea how much it means to us and uh really truly oh my gosh you go. <laughs> thank you so much joe oh that, that was uh oh that's so nice and look at that little star oh my gosh joe thank you that's so kind now to get more, uh, now donation. brixish gets to be on the goat list too so write down brixish's name because she's gonna go on the goat list mm. I do need to rearrange the goat list a little bit so you can see we have Moto and also yeah, Doc so, on here. But oh, Moto just popped into the chat, by the way. He yeah. Says, oh, looks like awesome. It would drift like a champ, and I see the chair <laughs> matching trend continues. Yeah. Yeah. It's 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 unavoidable. I. It's too cold. If if it's warmer, then I would wear a button-down shirt, and that's a little bit more colorful, like a plaid shirt or something. But can uh, you do me a huge favor and actually find the spot in the manual where the sticker is <laughs> on here, just so I can make sure I'm putting it on the right brick. Oh, Sorry about that. But yeah, thank you so much, Brixish. I love That's to see awesome. that little star. She says you're so welcome. Thank you. I said this one? That's very I mean, kind. You did the front one already, right? Yes, I think so. That's too kind. Yeah, and it's very friendly of YouTube to have this integrated system. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, just like straight in the middle of this one, huh? You're going to need a bigger board. Yeah, exactly. I think the board is going to go Oops. maybe on the left here, like on the edge here. -ish. Or and maybe we'll, we'll just get side. another one. Or another Maybe one. we'll have two boards, but we have yeah, to figure out a way to show everything properly. Oh, no. Whoa, no way. Lord of the Bricks, thank you. Look at that little Ooh. starfy. Oh, uh, that, that, I still need to fix the chat, but you can see it here. Yeah. Susie said, I love you too, says Brickshish. And I said, hello, Sarah. It's a great stream, but you can read Lord of the I'm Bricks. I'm happy to support you guys. Love you both very much. P.S. My footpath is shoveled and salted. Yeah, yes. Sarah, I sent you another picture. I'll have oh, to awesome. check that out, Nate. Thank you so much. Let me check that and see what that okay, looks like stop. now. Thank you very much. You guys are too kind to me. Exactly. Oh, yeah, that does look much nicer. So he has a nice walking path now to get to the door. Okay, that's good. Then it gets to his yeah, car, right? Yeah. Exactly. Wow, that snow is crazy. I'm not used to those types of snow levels. That is crazy. Crazy snow. Crazy snow. You want to pop these wheels yes. on here? What? Okay. No way. Lego Mike. Thank you. Oh, Lego Mike is going to go on the board. Oh, Lego Mike gets to be on the goat list now. Thank you, Lego Mike. Thank you so much. Moto says the stars are out tonight. I don't know if you mean the people in the chat being stars or. Was that again or did it just. Yes, it was again. It's here looking what? at the sound, but it's Brickfella here. Oh, sorry. oh, Brickfella. Thank you so much. Oh, my goodness. Wow, you guys are so kind. Thank you. Thank you very much. It really helps. I know it seems like a small thing sometimes, but it means a lot like to show the support and also it really does help a lot. It truly does. Everything goes back into some of the expenses, maybe some better editing software at some point and things that will really help me to keep yeah. doing YouTube, which is what I really <laughs> want to do right now with you guys. That's so definitely something thank you we so need much. to look into because Sarah is getting frustrated with iMovie. I'm getting frustrated with iMovie. So maybe we'll uh, get some so some proper editing software going. So and thank yeah, you so much. Let me, let me check my Amazon. I think they already shipped those stars. I just want to see where they are. <laughs> Samad says, I love seeing all these donations. And Brickfellow's message, by the way, was keep up the great content. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. It's truly very appreciated. So uh, thank you, guys. They're on the road with DHL. So it says they're here Thursday, so if DHL drops them on Thursday evening, then we can write some of their in the stream. Put some stars up. They won't be big stars. It takes a while to get them. Yeah, I don't know where they came from. So but yeah, I like, our, I like our goat list, and now we have some new names to add to the goat list, which is really awesome. So, very cool, you guys. We really have to order some more letters for the letter board, so oh, I have to remember to do that I today. I to charge both my phone as well. Brixish. I don't care how long I wait as long as there's more Brixish content that keeps me entertained, says Lego Loser. Yeah, I love I love Brixish's stuff as well. I wish she would make more videos, but we're always we're always ready for them whenever she wants to make anything. Yeah, Moto says the donation stars, definitely. 
Yeah, I think that it was Land of Sweet that came up with a great idea to do like stars because it's our star bricks. Yeah. So, uh, and I really like that, but we have to wait for them to come in the mail. Uh, if we, they, we write the name on there, it will always be there. And we can, even if they're not on the wall, they should be self sticky, but then Aww. we can always save them and put them somewhere else. That's so nice. Brickfellow says, I just want to make sure I'm supporting the creators that I'm consuming. Aw, mm-hmm. thank you very much. It really is appreciated. Yeah, I think we, we feel the same way as well. Mm-hmm. Lord of the Brick says, Sarah, Mike, I'm looking forward to seeing the stars. I mean, I'm not going to lie. I felt discouraged at some points during this YouTube journey and the encouragement that I've received through comments, kindness, and support really has kept me going for sure. So I really do appreciate it quite a lot. The people in this community are just the best and I look forward to getting to know more people that our inner community even better throughout time like especially when we can do conventions again and maybe meetups oh, yeah. that would be really fun and i, I, I know i would love to meet some of the people in person, yeah. yeah i feel like some of the people that we've met in this youtube community are like lifelong friends now so really yeah, definitely just, means a lot like i said so welcoming i mean i i, I met, made friends through the gaming youtube community and i met sarah through it but uh it's like times three the the generosity and kindness and warmth that uh, i've never had like i mean i've had also my share fair of like hot debates and frustration and bullying in the gaming community i've never seen it here in the lego community lego mike says we need a sarah star <laughs> shirt yeah we were actually talking i think last stream about what type of merchandise would be fun to do at some point I think the channel is like really not in a like crazy <laughs> spot where so it's small. it's still such a small little channel, but it just it's sounds like somebody with millions of people. It does, do yeah. Like. It's a small channel, so I'm not sure about merchandising, but it would be cool maybe to have a couple fun things. I I do think stuffed animals would be cute. I'll keep it in mind that a shirt might be fun, but I have to think of something that is gonna be like looking it's- looking great on anybody. So. Uh, we would also have to look into if that's allowed, right? I don't think Sarah can just take this star and put it on a shirt and sell it as her own, right? No, I don't think so, but there might be a little bit of a way around it in a way. I can explain more to you later about yeah. that. But yeah, I mean, we and we could come up with other things as well. If I have somebody design something that we can use that is not infringing on Lego, yeah. maybe we could do that as well. But that's that's really nice. And uh, Adam, you're more than welcome to send me a friend request on Discord. Go for it. I will just accept it when I'm on there again. <laughs> Samad says, no, we need some Sarah Starbricks merch. Yeah, I think stuffed animals would be really cute at some point. And maybe coffee mugs because I like coffee or like a coffee tumbler. And definitely a shirt. What else? A hat. Hats are kind of cool. Like a baseball hat. Do people wear those anymore, though, or not really? I don't know. I don't know. What would you guys like? I think you have that all integrated, right? Mm -hmm. You can do it through Streamlabs or through YouTube. You can do, like, merchandising. Yeah, it's just a fun thing. But I need a little bit of uh, proper graphic design first, so I would probably need to hire somebody to actually make some proper designs for the channel, I would think, that don't infringe again on Lego. So... (laughs) I mean, yeah, we definitely need a graphic designer. I mean, Sarah isn't rolling out YouTube membership yet, but she had no, like an no. amazing idea for like the the like member badges. Yeah. We're not sharing that yet because, but that that was that that, that sounds really fun. We'll see. And I'm trying. I wear caps. Oh, yeah, oh we... okay. Yeah, Lego Loser loves hats. We know uh, Lego Loser has actually mentioned it several times how she is almost always wearing hats. So she really loves hats a lot. Mm-hmm. And uh, Lord of the Bricks suggests Teespring merchandising. Is that like a place to go through? Yeah, I think I think YouTube partners with Teespring. Or ah. it's, it, it, it's, it's a common platform. They take care of everything. They have global distribution and stuff like that. I mean, I think I'd want things that people would want to use, but also like random stuff. Like I said, plushies are really fun. But what what's something fun and like random that people would actually want to have? Like, what about candles? Is that weird to sell, like, a candle? Like, I don't know. Like, I just want something really random. I was thinking more like, uh, 
like tweezers with your Sarah name on it. Then when you put stickers or clickers mm, on there. Nah, I don't want to be associated with tweezers. That seems weird. I don't know. I'm just thinking because you do stickers or clickers. I yeah. Just kind of like a, a channel thing. But I guess you could do that with uh, on a notebook or on, a, mm. I don't know, shirt or whatever you want to do. Usually you have like funny things on shirts that you can buy or cute pictures. And yeah. Do we have merchandise? I think, I think the channel needs to be a little bit bigger before we go into merchandising. But <laughs> I do I do like these ideas, though. You guys are uh, very ambitious. Yeah, Lego Mike, Sarah sunglasses, twenty nine ninety nine. Oh, yeah, that's a good one, Lego Mike. I like that, yeah. You like Brixish's I, idea? I do like that. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> that's interesting, Brixish. I mean, it'd be kind of funny, though. Scissors. Doc Sampson face palms over Brixish's <laughs> idea. I mean, I'm not going to lie, though. It would be kind of like, I I'm not sure how to feel about that because in a one way, it's like unique. But in another way, I'm not sure that I really want like my logo or something like in that general vicinity on a human body. I'm not sure how I feel about that one. <laughs> I think I would be so weirded out if you were in a Lego store and somebody would wear like a Sarah Starbrick shirt. Why? That sounds that would like be cool. so crazy. We're just sitting nah. here in a house building Lego. Like, that sounds it would be really cool. crazy. It would be neat. It would be fun. What's the point of ordering 200 stars when the stars are already in the chairs? Aw, oh, thanks, Lego like loser. That's kind. It's a big galaxy out there. That's kind. A sticker. Stickers, yeah. I like. I do like stickers. A Lego oh, brick with your name. Wow, you guys have great ideas. I think I think all the people in the chat need to be on the merchandising team because you guys are full of great ideas. Gosh. I wonder if you get in trouble if you like, have a designer like draw over your star and change it up. Well, that's what I was thinking because I was thinking of the time when Matt Elder actually drew my logo for... Mm -hmm his stream or for something oh, yeah, for the yeah, community yeah. stream or I, I can't actually remember why that was but it's really cool but if you use art like I feel like if you do have art from somebody of course if we use somebody's art you have to make sure that that's oh, yeah, okay you, you or pay, pay them the person, but yeah, if you make art of something that you want to use then maybe you can get away with it I'm not sure yeah I think I think there are ways around it <laughs> That would be wild to see someone wearing your merch as Moto. Yeah, I mean, that, that that's... Oh, well, that's we would wear a Moto shirt, though. I yeah. would totally... Does Moto sell shirts? Hi, has your stickers. The stickers are really cool. Yeah, the stickers are nice. But I would definitely wear a shirt as well with Moto on it. That's cool. Or the bricks. I would gladly <laughs> advertise a Sarah Starbuck shirt. I would gladly model that. You can be on the on the page then for purchasing. Yeah, like then. The, 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 the post. Nate, you're gonna be the model for the shirt. I'll just send it to you for free, and you'll just be like having these cool pictures of you wearing it, and then people will want to buy it because of your modeling. <laughs> You've already <laughs> offered it, so you can't back out now. <laughs> Nate's the model for the men's shirt. <laughs> That's hilarious. Mahan says, a Sarah Starbucks fridge. What, you wanted something random? <laughs> yeah, I mean, a Samsung mini fridge would be pretty cool, though. What if you had, like, a pink mini fridge with a star on it? That would be cool. That's crazy. A mini fridge you could definitely do. Maybe not a full-on fridge, but sure, a mini fridge. Why what not? Doc say? Doc said something to sort of drop a little bit. Let me see. You put your logo on there and then not your face. <laughs> yeah. I think the logo, the logo, not a face. Yeah. That's, yeah. Yeah. Well, that one is funny too. I like that one. Which one? Uh, Doc's idea for the, the waffle the iron. Waffle so iron? The waffle iron? Yeah. That is a star shape. That's cute. I do like it's that too. Fun. You guys are like full of amazing ideas. And Adam says, I'll do Sarah Star Burgers. Wow. That's cute. Yeah. <laughs> Lord of the Brick says, I'll sign a contract. He wants to do the modeling for the men's mm -hmm. for the men's clothing line. <laughs> I think a waffle iron or like a taiyaki uh, machine, like these uh, these these cakes. Oh, Bricktube Dave, are you not part of the Discord server? Do you need an invitation link? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that what the problem is? Let me find you. I want a, a mic T-shirt. It. Uh, well, it's just me. Who says that? Uh, creativity. Mm. It's all about Sarah. I'm just I'm I'm just uh, hanging out here, helping out. Um, let me see if I can get an invite link. I don't know how Sarah truly feels about this whole soup meme situation that's going on, but uh, 
Maybe it's my face with a tomato soup can or something. I don't know. It sounds kind of weird. Oh, and oh my hair looks uniform. horrible today. Oh, my gosh. Really beautiful. Oh, yeah. I like these ideas, you guys. Yeah, here. Custom huge 3D Lego minifigure. Kind of like what uh, um, Ash and Flash and uh, Potter think... Minifig Pals have. I think I'm those on the wrong cool. count, though. That they designed that and got that. Yeah, TV those printer. are really neat. I but there's still no sig fig of Sarah, so that needs to come I have first. to make a sig fig, but I will. Yeah. And Adam says he sent me a friend request. No problem. I'm That's trying it. to put a link in the chat. A water bottle. That's a great idea, Samad. Oh, no, I disagree with that. Sarah has streamed without me before, especially when I was very busy with work in the summertime. I wasn't there for like three weeks. I had meetings all the time. Sarah was streaming by herself. Aw, Dean, thank you. He says you look gorgeous. Thank you so much, Dean. <laughs> thank you. I appreciate yes. it. Cookie cutters and Water pop sockets bottle. with the logo. Ooh, pop sockets. I like that. Those That's cool, good. Lego loser. I do like that. I feel like we need to be writing these down. Well, Gosh. this chat is still here. You guys have here. good ideas, though. What if you make a cat toy so it presents your channel and love of cats? Aw, <laughs> that's cool. But yeah, I like the pop socket idea. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I do like that a lot. I mean, or right? yeah, it seems like something kind of easy to get made. And uh, Adam says he made me a sig fig. That's nice, Adam. I have a lot of random pieces and parts, so hopefully you gave my sig fig blonde hair. <laughs> Midnight Mox has a light up star clock. Wow, this is a lot of ideas. Look Wait, a what? A clock. A like clock? A clock in the shape of your room. Wow. Wow, you guys have good ideas. My gosh. Those are nice ideas. Sarah Starbursts. Mm. Candy. Mm. Candy, definitely, yeah. I think candy. I should still ask my sister. Candy would be amazing, you guys. I don't know if she still bakes stuff or if she still has access to baking cakes and stuff like that. Yeah, Samad Salami, I did read your suggestion about the Sarah Starbricks water bottle, and I like that suggestion a lot. Like I think a water bottle stuff. would be good. It can go with the tumblers and the coffee yeah. mug. Reusable like cups and glass and tumblers like that are so helpful. You just have to make a variety of stuff, I feel like though. Not everything can just have like a logo on it. I feel like you have to have like cute and funny stuff. So I'd have to come up with some fun jokes and funny things to put on things. But yeah, I like these ideas. You know, like stickers or clickers or yeah. players. Or... These are cool ideas. A Sarah Starbricks book. That probably actually entails actually making a book, though, but that's also an idea. A book? Like the biography of the channel? or Well, you do have like 200 years, 300 years to, to share. Mm -hmm. 300 years of stories. Yeah, that's from true. From a vampire unicorn. We didn't have Lego for a long time, though, so Lego is very recent in mm -hmm. my life. That's true. I wonder what we were building with 200 years ago. And BrickTube Dave just joined the uh, Discord awesome. server. Awesome, BrickTube Dave. Well, welcome to the server, and hopefully I can extend you a proper welcome. You can share pictures and your builds and mocks and whatever you're interested in on YouTube and Lego. Happy to share that. What if you make a plushy Paris and all the money goes to her? Aw, that's nice, Mahan. That is a nice idea. Have to be careful about that though, but I do like that idea. Kip Nugget shirt. Oh yeah, Kip Nuggets. You're totally right, Lego Mike. Kip Nuggets needs to be on a shirt. Like a Kip or... half eaten Kip Nugget or something with a bite taken. It has it? to be cute though. Like a cute Kip Nugget. <laughs> like maybe a picture of a chicken that's like Kip Nuggets. <laughs> it has to be cute. I like that though. Kip Nuggets should be on something. In case those of you out there in the chat don't know what we're talking about with Kip Nuggets, Kip is the Dutch word for chicken. So we're talking about chicken nuggets, but in the Netherlands they call them Kip Nuggets. And Lego Mike is the one who started talking about Kip Nuggets and we're like, yeah, we actually do like Kip Nuggets quite a bit. So a Sarah Starbucks Moshi pillow. Aw, that's cute, Midnight Mox. I like that. I like that. You guys have amazing oh, ideas. We have, a, we have a full store. Where do we keep all this stuff? Lego Loser says, make a phone case or a shirt that says, don't duel my lady. Because Mike said that on CC stream. That's a good one. 
But do who say that I say was it Lego Loser? Or I think I don't remember who wanted to duel me. I think, I think it was, it was Lego, Lego Loser, and then you were like, "Don't like, duel don't my duel lady." My lady. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, I feel like these are some great ideas. There's some fun things happening on this chainsaw so hybrid. Hmm. I feel like something pretty, like a necklace, would be nice too. I really like stars a lot, and it's actually weird because I used to have these star earrings, and I wore them all the time, and I love those earrings, so. It's kind of cool that that's part of my channel thing now. It's kind of neat. Bricktube Dave says, Sarah Starbrick's phone case. An ashen flash big 3D minifig butt of Sarah. Yeah, they had a nice idea. I gotta be careful not to copy other people, though, but I did, I did like that a lot. That's super cute that they did that. They're very, uh. They're very creative. Also yeah, that, that, very that creative. The cats with the box and everything. I don't know how to go about making anything like that. That's that was really cool. Lord of the Bricks is creating a list of some of these amazing ideas. That's awesome, it's Nate. A new, new section in Discord. It's like <laughs> Sarah merch. Oh gosh. It's it's still too early for all. This I mean, stuff, we just hit a thousand subscribers a week ago, so <laughs> you guys, uh, you know, keep in mind the channel is quite small, but it's fun though. It's, it is a lot of fun, fun, and I do like plushies. I mean, I have no idea what the future holds. I, I really don't. I have no aspirations of this growing into like a million or even 50,000 subs. Why would you have aspirations well, you, for, for my you, channel? For, for, I mean, for you, I don't see that happening. Oh, you don't believe my channel could get a million subs? I, I, I'm, I'm, you can do it. You can definitely do it. I just, you know, we're in this niche, right? But what I was going to say is my point being... It's, it's great to see everybody that has been here since the beginning. I, I, we like that. Like everybody yeah. who has been here since the beginning. The people in this community are really awesome. And I feel like the group that we have that come to the streams are really, you guys are awesome and the best out of the people in the community. So we really enjoy hanging out a lot with you guys. Thomas says, I tried joining your Discord. How do you do that? You have to click the link and click accept. It's an app that you have uh, to have downloaded. Yeah, you have to have Discord. Computer. Do you use Discord, Thomas? Brixer says Mike is digging that hole. Yeah, it's just a little weird sometimes because he talks about how he doesn't have aspirations for my channel to do something, but how would you know uh, what my goals are for the channel? Maybe well, I want I, 2 I, million I, views. The word aspirations was the wrong word. I just, let's just say I'm also like... Realistic? Be, is yeah, that the word well, realistic again? Because I hear the word realistic a lot as well. In this. I think that would be super cool, right? I think it would be super cool, but I don't want to like put that out there and then it doesn't happen because it's I, I don't like the my, her or my dreams to be shattered and I'm very realistic too so but hey well, she can do it she I have a lot it. of dreams but some of them are just kind of normal girl dreams like getting married and stuff like I, that I want to do that too nice dreams but I haven't really thought that much you guys about like how far I really want to take the YouTube channel I think it would be cool to grow it a little bit more but I do like it small because I think Mahan was talking about it a little while ago how he really likes channels to stay a little bit smaller and I do feel like there's something special about having a more intimate group of people like it's people you know it's people that you actually get to know what's going on in their lives and how things are going and I do really like that a lot so I wouldn't even want to be like some huge channel but i'll think about some of these fun ideas i like i i just like the idea because if you make your own merchandise you can even have your own stuff too which would be cute would i imagine be, having an adorable star plushie it would be absolutely sad for both of us if we were streaming and there's just no way to talk to everybody in the chat I would feel so sad i mm. see some of the other streamers and it goes so fast and i feel like i feel like nate is on like the same like level of vibe as I am. He says optimism, Mike. Okay. Optimism. Okay. I'm very optimistic as well, and sometimes so you're, you're hitting all your goals. And yeah, exactly. To everybody else, mm -hmm. and the the community here is just really great. I, I like supporting everybody, not just Sarah Starbridge, but also all the other content creators here, and speaking yeah. to everybody in all the other chats and having fun jokes and you know. Ad Adam says 2000 by my birthday. When's your birthday again, Adam? October, I think. It's October, right? I think if your birthday is in October, I think I could do 2000 by then. And Helga is here. She says, you lose the authenticity of connection with large channels. That's very true. And Moto says, Sarah Star blows up. Sarah creates a new channel and wears a disguise. But everyone knows that sweet voice. Aw. That's nice. 
Yeah. I, uh, I, mm, it's something I actually have to figure out though about having multiple channels because I do want to do some game stuff too. Not primarily as a focus, but just here or there. Because I do want to play through some of my games as well. And I think it would be fun and probably more motivating to actually go through my video games if I have like company while I'm playing them. So I have to figure out how I'm going to do that. Yeah, we need yeah. to try it out. But you, you need at least a monitor here. Animo says October. Yeah, so 2,000 right. subs by October. Yeah, I take that wager, Adam. I can think that that can be done, I think. I think it can be done. I think it can be done. <laughs> Lego Loser Production says paint the wall behind you black and then put the yellow stars on the wall and some shelves with cute plushies. Yeah, I did think that we should get a black like paper and draw on it and put the stars as constellations on black because you'll be able to see the stars better that way. But I like that idea, Lego Loser. And Brickworm says Moto just wants a new Fox show, The Masked A Fall. Oh my <laughs> gosh, that would be amazing. I would be such a giveaway though, Moto's right. I think people would recognize me. I'd have to really work hard at disguising the way that I sound. I'm trying to think of other people because there's a lot of people that come on streams that don't show their faces, but I recognize their voices instantly, like BFAB. I always know when I hear BFAB for the most part. I wonder um, how, how- The masked A-fall. I wonder how this would look if we paint the wall or have like a very dark black background though. Wouldn't it look like too- Crazy. dour like yeah. depressing i don't know we have to figure out some way to make the stars show up i think what we'll do is we'll experiment a little bit with how it looks when we put them when they come in we'll put some on the wall and we'll see what they look like on the stream and we'll have to kind of tweak it from there to make sure that they look nice and g fat jake is here hey g fat jake thank you so much for coming by bricktube dave says my goal is 5,000 subs wow that's an awesome goal I think you can do it if you keep on going. Might take a while, but you can get there. Samad says she's at 1.7 already. That's 1. true. 0, 7, yeah, 1.07. 1,700, not 1,700. Correct. That would be crazy. Yep. And Crazy Tivity says 2,000 by October. Easy. Well, we'll see. We'll see. I'll try. I think it can be done, though, Adam. It's a good goal. That is a great goal. Have you accepted my friend request? No, I haven't been on Discord. I've been on the live stream, Samad. <laughs> I promise I'll accept it when I get done here, though, when I go on Discord. Lego Loser says, play the Sims on live streams, and in the household, you and Mike live in it, and if you have the pet pass, then make it Paris. Yeah, I do have the Sims, and I like playing that game a lot. I have the Pets expansion on the PlayStation 4, so that's definitely an option of something I could play, and I love playing Sims. Oh, my gosh. You want to try that out after the stream? Like setting it up so at least you, you know how it would work maybe we should do that tomorrow though but we can think about it i don't know i'll maybe think about it yeah but we should check it out and try to do a test on that the problem is that i don't want to be like utilizing your laptop because i feel like that would be something that i could also do while you're like doing work things sometimes and obviously i can't do that if i have to use your work laptop yeah, that is the problem. So that's kind of the problem we'll, with yeah, it. Yeah, we'll, we'll try that out on your laptop. And see if it can even work. I don't know how difficult that is. Congratulations, uh, GFAT. GFAT hit 100 subs. Oh, that's awesome. Right. That's great, GFAT Jake. The first 100 is the hardest one to get. So hardest. good job. Good job. It really is. That, that one's a toughie. Hey, Bridge Toys. Happy Monday to you as well. Hi, Jazz. Is it still Pirate Monday? Thanks for coming by. <laughs> <laughs> says i have sims 4 <laughs> omg <laughs> yeah i'm i try to stay away from playing the sims though because it's really addictive what, what were you what what were you wanted to play first as well again pokemon right yeah i need to finish pokemon so i need to finish pokemon sword maybe people can hang out with me while i finish up finally i have to catch the legendary and beat the champion and then i have to do some dlc on it i mean i just on the on i'm very focused when it comes to finishing or beating games and getting that credits she is like two months already like you're like right in front of the final boss or something for pokemon and she just like turned it off and she's like, yeah i'll do it tomorrow and now we're two or three months later and i'm like i could not do that i have to beat that game 
Adam wants to know if the stream is ending soon. Yeah, I think it's going to be winding down pretty soon here, Adam. We've been going for three and a half hours. Mondays is always a little bit of a longer day for streaming for us now because on Thursdays, it is a very tight two hours on Thursdays that we can stream unless we start those streams earlier sometimes. But there's um, some other people streaming on Thursdays, like my friend Sai O'Connor, and I really enjoyed joining for his streams as well. So... We stream till a certain point on Thursdays, which means on Mondays we stream kind of till whenever. What is it? Is Bricks in Lithuania here? Really? Or Did I miss Bricks in Lithuania? I didn't see that. And Teal Bricks in Paradisa is here. Hey, Teal Bricks. Welcome. Gallifrey Bricks is here as well. Hey, Gallifrey. GFET Jake wants to know, does it get easier after 100? I'm pretty sure it does. Um, You know, for me, I... I you'll, you'll run into bumps. Sorry. I'm uh, going to say that it depends on your channel, and everybody's channel growth is different. For me, I did not experience a huge jump in growth um, for a long time, and I stuck around the 200 mark. 250 for a long time gfet jake it took a long time but then once i was making daily content for a little while and i was really working hard on that it really amped up quite a bit so everybody's growth pattern is really different but i would i would say just keep at it the more that you have people watching the more you'll get into recommendations and it just takes time to really build up the kind of network of of all of the algorithm type stuff. I'm still also learning about it myself, but keep keep heart and stay patient. Dean says I should have picked a bigger build. I already built three sets plus two poly bags. Whoa. Awesome. Which poly bags did you build, Dean? Adam says I don't think I'll ever get 100 with stop motions. I get 10 subs every month. Yeah, um, I, I think that there's a very... It's tough. A very, stop yeah, I was going to say it's a niche kind of group that like to watch stop motion videos. So if that's something that you just really enjoy doing, then you just have to focus on what you love to do. But if you really want to grow more, then you also need to look, if your primary focus is growth on your channel and attracting people to it and not just doing the things you want to do, then you need to start looking at more trends and what is popular News, and what people are pitfalls. interested in seeing sadly Reviews. so sometimes you have to make choices about what you really want to do versus was, uh, the popular wasn't it uh mr source their channel started as a stop motion channel mm -hmm. and that went on for years and yeah. look where it is now you know you... but i think it's like that in life anyways right it's like a balance between doing what you want to do but also doing what other people want you to do so yeah exactly it's yeah. always like gotta that find gotta find the balance like Loser Production says, me and my brother made a household and he promised that we would live there and then he married a woman that looked pretty and kicked their husband out and then we trapped her in a room to die and now she's a ghost. I think you mentioned that Lego Loser Productions one other time when we were talking about Sims. That's really funny. And yeah, some crazy stuff happens in The Sims. I've seen some really crazy stuff. Jazz says that it's Ninjago Monday today. For him. And GFET Jake says thanks. I appreciate the support. Mahan says, remember 2018? Brick Attack won the lottery of life and grew 1k subs every month live streaming more than a human can think about. Hmm. Yeah, and Brick's Toy says, or have a shorts blow up. That's true. Samad wants to know when will the stream end. I have to go to a 10 minute video and I don't want to miss the end. Um, oh gosh, that's a good question. I don't know. Probably soonish though. I think we're going to have dinner in a few. Telltale Bricks is here as well, by the way. Hey, Telltale. Welcome. Dean says he built the little red Christmas train and a jet ski. Aw, thanks, BrickTube Dave. He made a custom 1K sub play button. Thanks. That's very kind. Try some YouTube shorts, says Crazytivity to Adamo to get more views on your channel.
And Legaloozer says, no one can say that stop motions can get nowhere because there's a stop motion channel with a million subscribers. Yeah, there is. Yeah. That's true. I just think it's the same with Lego as well. It's stop motions, but it's also the whole Lego thing as well. It's a um, very small community. That's the interesting thing about it. Also, London Bridge Bricks came by. Hi, Greg. Hey, Greg. He says, hey, how's everyone doing? Just popping in to say a big hello. Well, thank you so much for coming by. It's always much appreciated. And I hope you're feeling better. Yeah, how are you feeling, Greg? Geek Girl Bricks is here. Hey, Geek Girl Bricks. Welcome. I think you must be new to the channel and the stream, so welcome to the Sarah Starbricks channel. Happy to have you come on by. Bricks just says she hasn't played Sims in ages. And Crazytivity is giving some suggestions and pointers on shorts. AKA videos not longer than 60 seconds. Yeah, Adam O does make pretty short videos. A lot of his videos are only like 10 seconds and stuff like that, but I'm not sure that he's putting it in the shorts format, which is a vertical style also, as though you're shooting it from a cell phone. I think Modo is going. Oh, bye Modo. Yeah, you missed that. Was he leaving or did so someone else leave? Aw, thanks Modo. Well, I don't know if she's saying bye to somebody else. Bye. Bubuki says, you guys are still live? Yeah, Mondays is kind of a open think, day for... I think we're ending it. Up we're soon. ending it soon here. We built this little uh, camper van as well. Which With the bouquet of flowers yeah. and the roses. Greg says, for the first time in over a week, I'm starting to feel well again. Aw, oh, Greg. Oh, that's better. I'm glad you're feeling a little bit better, but I'm sorry that you've suffered through a bad week with not feeling well. It's always the worst when you don't feel good. That's awful. And Lego Loser says she just ordered some white sticky tack for stop motions. That's cool. Very cool. Mahan says, I didn't ask when will the stream end. Yeah, it should be soon. Should be soon. We're just kind of hanging out. Where are the chairs? What? They're inside. Oh, this is all inside? Yeah. Well, the little table is. Is that supposed to be outside? Well, no, it just says so oh. outside on the bed, so I was wondering where this Is this one where the roof pops off? Yeah. Or does it actually, oh yeah, it's both. It opens like this as well. But yeah, the chairs are actually inside. I didn't realize you could just pop them out for the, mm -hmm. like we're gonna hang out outside and have our little fried egg out there. Mm -hmm. It's pretty cute. I always like these campers a lot. Two months in and I still don't own a 2021 set, says Saman Salami. And uh, Lego Loser wants to know to Mahan if the X-Wing was worth it. Will you get Diagon Alley? Uh, Lego Loser Productions, I actually own Diagon Alley already and we built it on an old live stream a while ago. I should probably honestly make more reviews about sets that I already have so that people will know mm -hmm. more easily what I already have, but I've just, I don't know, I was on a really good roll with making videos, and then things got a little bit off track with the kitty cat, and now I really should get back into making them again. But yeah, I should do some reviews on some of the stuff I have, or at least show it. This is a cute camper van. Yeah. It's nice. So what's the plan on Thursday? Yeah, we've already mentioned it. I'm going to put out a community post and you guys can vote on which set you would be interested in seeing built on Thursday's stream. And unfortunately, that will be, like I said, a very short two-hour stream, but it can be the beginning of whatever we're going to work on next, and that'll be fun. And what's and... happening on Saturday? uh on saturday oh yeah that's actually a good point saturday uh february 20th is actually my birthday so on um, on saturday it will be my birthday and we will probably stream for a few hours on the sarah starbricks channel cc cafe corner is also doing a really awesome live stream on saturday which is a 14 hour charity stream so it's really cool and you guys should definitely check that out i will also be joining on her channel a couple times throughout the day to hang out talk to the panel she's going to have a female panel for 
uh, portion of the stream as well, which I will be joining for. But yeah, so on Saturday, it'll be a really busy, fun day with with me doing a little bit of a birthday stream and also Cafe Corner doing a 14 hour, 14 hour live stream. Wow. 117 Legion is here. Hey, 117 Legion. Lennon Bridge Brick says the van looks really good. I loved last year's ice cream van to bits. Yeah. That's a good one too. The ice cream van was really good. What's yeah, this so... weird mark across the top? <clears throat> Sorry. So what yeah, CC, CC and Sarah will overstream a little bit, but I think yeah. all the exciting stuff for CC is happening at the later part of her stream because that's when everybody is waking up. But uh, yeah. I hope everything will go well. Uh, it's not like the Christmas stream where it's going to be like 10,000 presents for, for, for Sarah no, no, it's because just... of the situation that we had with Paris. But it's mostly just uh, to uh, to build some more. And uh, there we may be bringing cake. I wish we could share that through the screen. Yeah. That would be that, that would be amazing because uh, I think there will be more than enough cake than for two people. Adam says he's going to be at CC's and our stream, and Lord of the Brick says he'll be there all day at CC's. Yep. Yeah. And yeah, it'll be a lot of fun. What time will the fourteen-hour stream start? I don't actually know that. You probably should ask CC about that or check out her already yeah, scheduled, scheduled link. It. I'm pretty sure it's scheduled online, so you can probably see exactly the time it's starting. UK time. Mm -hmm. I think it's noon UK time on Saturday because I think it starts at 1 p.m. for us. Hi, Zarar. Wow, I feel like we really need to start streaming like longer on Mondays. Remember that one time? I think when we streamed for like four or five hours, there's a lot of people who show up later on at the stream. You want to stream for more? No, we should eat though. We should eat dinner. But yeah, Brixus says, says mm, cake. Yeah. I wish we could share it. I truly, truly do. I wish yeah. it was just easy to be like passing out cake to everybody digitally. BFAB says, I better stock up on making videos so I can catch y'all streams. Yeah, CC's is 14 hours, so mine will be like a normal, Too normal bad. sized yeah. stream for me, but it'll be a little birthday celebration. And Yeah, 7 or 8 a.m. Eastern. She starts really early in the morning and then she goes all the way until the evening. So yeah, I think she starts at 7 a.m. Eastern and she goes until 11 p.m. Eastern. That's, that's 14 hours or something like that. My, my math is maybe off. Oh, Sarah Star Cake. That would be cute. I think the cake is already ordered, though, but... <laughs> I hope everything will go well. They're supposed to deliver it on her day. So. The Dutch are a little bit weird about cakes, like on Mike. So maybe that's it's... important to ex explain that they don't really sell normal birthday cake in the Netherlands. I have no idea why, but when you buy a cake in the Netherlands, it's basically like whipped cream on top of a pie. We First of all, adult birthday cakes is not really a thing at most you get this thing called slagroomtaart which is whipped cream cake and it's just chopped nuts and almonds around in a circle and just whipped cream and just very plain cake no fancy flavors no nothing it's nigh impossible to get a normal birthday yes. cake in this country so we're hoping that the place that Somewhere got the cake from is like i sure from. hope it's like more like a normal birthday cake because every year when we get cake it's more like a pie. They don't really sell birthday cake here. It's really weird. In the U.S., I feel like you can get amazing cakes. You can get whatever you want on a cake. But here, you it's so hard to get a normal birthday cake. It's really weird. Bricktube Dave says, In the Discord, I just sent the subscriber play button. Thanks, Bricktube Dave. Lego Loser says, Make a homemade cake. Oh, yeah. That's uh, <laughs> a good idea for next year. I just wanted to get uh, Sarah some cake. I... Like I said, I, I wish I could give her more, but uh, we'll... Uh, yeah, we'll it's been time. a complicated situation with the cat for the mm -hmm. last, like... So it's okay. I don't expect anything too crazy or anything. It's... I mean, we have, like, some of the Lego stuff here that we had already bought, but it can't... Yeah. We can not really go crazy because Paris had a lot of I expenses. Up, I have to pick up two things tomorrow, so we'll probably open that on her stream. Mm -hmm. And then... Uh, there's something else that we can open on the stream, but isn't Lego related. Whoa. Lord of the Bricks says we're at 28 Sarah Starbricks merchandise Whoa. ideas. Nice. Good, pretty good brain stream. Uh, a brainstorm. <laughs> a brainstream. A I like that. Stream. It was a brainstream. It was a brainstream. <laughs> oh, you guys are a lot of big brains in here. Stream. It's some big brain ideas. So yes, but there will be birthday cake. We it's just really difficult to find it. Yeah, I found a place. And hopefully it'll be like more it, like it a looked, normal cake. It, it looked good. <laughs> Sarah got this, gave her seal of approval, and I hope they come deliver it on Saturday. 
and I probably have to call them to make sure it's all set and then hopefully they deliver it they, they, by the time the stream starts. Thanks, Brickworm. She says, happy early birthday, gotta run. Bye, Brickworm. Thanks for coming by and thanks for the early birthday wishes. We still have to set up the birthday stream. I sent you another pic, Sarah, says Lord of the Bricks. Happy 201 years. I'm actually over 300, Lego Mike. But, you know, a lady never wants to show her real, true age. Exactly. Wow, look at all these ideas. Wow. Lord of the Bricks sent the whole notepad full of ideas. Well. Wow. Right next to the stream, which, oh, I look, I look weird today, you guys. That's okay. But yeah, I don't know if you guys have any other ideas for the birthday stream. I know we've, we've never done that before. I don't know. No, but we'll we'll, we'll just hang out and have some fun. Or something like that. We'll build Lego, of course. Yeah. And GFET really Jake, unfortunately, has gotten some toxic people. That's not good. People no, have sent some mean stuff. That's unfortunate. Just yeah, ignore those cool. people. That's not cool, though. Just uh, block ban from channel. Yeah. You know. Yeah, I'm here. Well. You know, I gotta keep it positive. We really appreciate you guys all coming and hanging out, and I guess we're going to end it. Bye, Adam. We're also ending it as well, so yeah. perfect timing. You're turning 407 too, Sarah. How did you know, BFAB? But uh, <laughs> we'll, we'll definitely see you guys all later on. Um, next time you can How catch us. Know? I don't know. That you were born in 1614. How you knew that exactly? Next time we'll see you guys is on Thursday. I have no idea how BFAB knows. Maybe I told him one time, but yeah, we'll uh, we'll see you guys all again on Thursday. Yes. If you want to come by, definitely check it out. Same channel, same place, same time for two hours of fun. And look for the community post, which will be my first one ever. I don't even know what we're going to build. So Am I allowed to you vote? guys can choose. You can vote if you want to. You guys can choose out of the four. I think I'm going to list four sets for you guys to vote from. And you can pick. And that's what we'll start on Thursday. So, uh, well... Till next time, thank you all so much for joining, and we'll see you guys all again really soon. Bye! Bye.